Oh, it makes me think of holidays. Uh, bronze light coming up for you as well. Kits, holidays, well, Christmas is done, so, you know. It's that time of year, isn't it, where you think you need to book a holiday now? Something to look forward to. Yes. Um, coming up for you this evening, the kits today are fabulous. Well, I did actually see, um, Katie, you posted a picture, I think it was on, it must have been on Instagram, uh, yesterday of the, uh, the kit that yeah. you've got. <gasps> Stunning. The Ethiopian opal. What I do know is that it's really, really limited, though, so you will have to be super duper quick um, if you do want that. I think it, isn't it like, I think there's like 30 something. It's like really low quantity wise um, for the kit. So that's coming up for you at 7 o'clock this evening. Uh, coming up for you at 6.30, I've got some amethyst. Oh, hang on, it says amethyst. Graduated Fasted Rondells, 2 by 1 to 6 by 4 I think it must be that strand. That's the one. <gasps> Look at these. Juicy. These are pretty. Coming up for you at 6.30 and at quarter to, uh, quarter to 7 as well. Have a look at these. These are brand new. Do you know the last time, they were sterling, these are base metals. They will be um, even more affordable. But the last time I had some Buddha charms, I think it was one of our quickest sellouts that we've ever had here at Joy Maker. Uh, it was to uh, promote the Sterling Silver Weekend that we had a long time ago now, uh, but I remember it well. These are going to be really, really popular. So these are coming up for you at quarter to seven. Brand new. I love these. These are fab, aren't they? Silver plated base metal. Coming up for you at a quarter to seven. Uh, if you do want to get interactive with us this evening, 60777 uh, on the text type message with the word JN Studio. If you're watching on the web, there is a little box just below the live feed that says send message to studio. If you type it in there and click send, it comes to on the same system. Uh, text topic, Becky. Anything you like. <laughs> Anything you Have you had any visitors over Christmas? <laughs> Um, Christmas dinner. I've had another one today. I've had another Christmas dinner. Didn't actually think I was here today, but I am. It's absolutely fine. But I still had my Christmas dinner and I bought some in. Becky, you've not actually had any, have you? She's not feeling very well, I'll bet. Uh, Adam, did you have some? You had a slice of ham. And Leah's bowl was that big. Did you see how much I bought in? I bought like enough for everyone. Are you going to take some home? Good. Because it can't go to waste. Good. Uh, so New Year's Eve is tomorrow. Hey, what are your plans? No plans, Beck. Casey, you doing no, anything tomorrow night? No, no plans. plans. Leah? Chilling. Chilling out? With the gin. Yeah. Chilling out with the gin. With the gin. Adam? <laughs> go to party. I'm actually going out. I'm going out for like Ooh. the first time. Out, out. I'm going out, out. Uh, actually, no, I'm not going out, out. I'm going out because uh, technically I'm going to be home by midnight. So, yeah, it's probably just out, not out, out. Um, yeah, I'm going out. It's exciting. Just for, yeah, just for, for uh, some dinner with friends and a little shindig. Yeah, some drinking. I'm excited. Uh, so yeah, New Year's Eve. Um, New Year's resolutions. Do you have any? Do you stick to them? I don't think many people do, do they? You've got to be strong-willed to stick to your New Year's resolutions. I don't ever make any. <laughs> You're still working on the same one, Adam, that you have been for the last five years. <laughs> Learn Spanish. That's a good one, though, but you still not, not done it. Are, we, are you actually learning it? Still learning it? Brilliant. There you go. He's coming on. And let us know what your New Year's resolutions are. 60777, start message with J and Studio. Um, this hour is under £10, so if you are happy... Uh, to spend nine pounds and ninety-five pence, just check out because that's the most you're going to spend in this hour. Have a look at these. Oh, <gasps> see, graduated. I don't know if I've ever had um, a graduated strand of snowflake obsidian before. They are really, really beautiful. I think when you get a graduated strand like this, it's really difficult for me anyway um, to cut the strand and take them apart. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah. It, it is difficult. Isn't yeah, it? I think if someone's taken that much time, just restrand them. Yeah, definitely, just restrand. I'll buy a cut, buy a few strands, and then you've yeah. got a selection of all the different size mm. size gemstones. Perfect. That's a good idea, isn't it? Maybe have the matching. In fact, you could even just take a couple off the end, couldn't you? Um, and have matching earrings if you wanted to. Look really, really pretty if you knotted them as well, wouldn't they? Hundred and seventy. If you snowflake obsidian, you've got here uh, five to ten millimeters in size, 
44 centimetre strand you have there. QJ, KZ87, 5.95. So you might be thinking 9.95 for everything. Think again. Uh, under £10, 5.95 with your postage as well, 3.95. Both of those combined under £10. Oh, 0800-644-655 or on the web at joymaker.com. Even when we're bringing you prices like this, there's no limits on how many you can purchase as well. You can get as many as you like. And remember, you've got a 30-day money-back guarantee as well on absolutely everything. It doesn't start from today. Uh, it starts from the day that you get them delivered to your door in a couple of days' time. Then you have 30 days to think about it to make your mind up. I can't imagine that any of these are going to come back. They're black and white. It's monochrome. They're going to go with everything, aren't they? It's going to fit straight into your stash. You're not yeah. going to have to worry about, oh, what am I going to put with this? Because yeah. they're just going to work. Exactly. You can yeah. put them in any colour gemstone, any colour kind of finding, any colour kind of thread. Winner, winner. Christmas dinner. <laughs> Yeah, but it is until the 6th of Jan. We decided this yesterday. It is actually Christmas till the 6th of Jan because your Christmas tree's up. So surely it's Christmas till the 6th of January. Your Christmas tree's down. What? Oh, <laughs> yours is real, so yours has taken itself down. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Right. Multicolor crackle quartz view. Have a look. <laughs> Have a look at these, really, really colourful. These are really, really pretty. I love the colours in these as well. That's the great thing about dyed gemstones is that we can pretty much have whatever colour um, we like with a dyed gemstone. These are fab, 12 millimetres in size. Your greens, your pinks, your teal hues, quite indicolite actually in their colour, these ones. That one there is quite speedy. I like, you can get a good few pairs out of these as well. So if you're wanting to make, um, earrings you can make a good few pairs of earrings with this no problem at all now what we do with crackle quartz um, is we heat it up to really really high temperatures and then we cool it down really really quickly uh, so it causes the gemstone to crack um, and then when we uh, inject that dye it fills the cracks and it gives us this fabulous fabulous effect with inside the gemstone fe gp 85 is your code for this one Eight pounds and ninety-five pence. You only eight chances left. That's all we have. You've got two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen. Oh, hang on a minute. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty, twenty-four, twenty-six, twenty-eight, thirty, thirty-two, thirty-three individual gemstones on that strand. Perfect for stretches. Perfect for just restranding as well, and perfect for using individually because they're so sizable. Twenty-seven pence per gemstone. So you're talking a pair of earrings, less than six pence cost Maybe. right have a ooh. night out with the girls New Year's Eve look at these really really sparkly love this strand and um, faceted rondelles as well normally um, I think more often than not we see black spinel as a micro faceted strand so these ones although they are small they're graduated rondelles that you've got here two by one to three by two millimeters in size and that is a 30 centimeter strand that you've got there these are oh, the Buddha charms I just put one of those on there one of the Buddha charms that's coming up a little bit later on that will look really really pretty and very on trend as well RL RU84 is your code for this one. Telephone number is at the bottom of your screen. If you are brand new and you're tuning in for the very first time this evening, uh, welcome to Jewelry Maker. It's a free telephone number to get involved. Give us a go. You've got a 30-day money-back guarantee with every single purchase. And with your very first purchase here at Jewelry Maker, you will get two genuine gemstone strands free of charge as well. How good is that? Um, this would be a perfect one to come in for actually because it is a black gemstone again it's going to go with anything you know if you are thinking where where do I start you know which gemstones should I get always start with your favorites obviously those that you are drawn to but in terms of classics in terms of gemstones that you can't go wrong with your white gemstones your clear gemstones and your black gemstones winner winner RLRU84 for £4.95, £4.95. You could use those as spacers, channel set with these as well. They look amazing channel set. It'd have to be sterling silver for me. But it doesn't matter. You can use whatever you want to with these. Or just simply re-stranded, uh, multi-stranded bracelet design. Really, really pretty. £4.95. So this one you can multi-buy under 10. Amazing. 
Bloody hell. Um, green agate with... Oh! Look at these. These are lovely. Do you know I love these gemstones that are not highly polished? For me personally, I'm... I much, much prefer um, the gemstones that are either irregular shapes or more in their natural form, if you like, to something that is, is, is perfectly symmetrical and perfectly faceted and polished. I love that organic look that you have with gemstones like these. Oh, these gorgeous. Look at that green as well. It's quite um, icy. Like it's making me think of glaciers. Yes. They're lovely, aren't they? Really, really Love pretty. Eight colors. mil rounds. That's a great size, isn't it, for a yeah, stretchy? Perfect size. That's the go to size for a stretchy. Yeah, definitely. and really, really easy to do as well. And actually, for me, I always say that green, you know, it's Mother Nature's backdrop. I think it's a colour that goes with everything. And I think it's a colour that you can wear every season as well. So that would be a really, really wearable piece of jewellery. Um, you know, for the start of the year, right through to next winter. Really, really pretty. You've got some lovely, lovely fresh green hues. You've got your deeper greens in there as well. And actually, with that matte finish, I think this would lend itself brilliantly to gent designs as well. So if you wanted yeah. to perhaps just pop one of them just into a macrame bracelet or, you know, a few of them. Yeah. Even yeah, a gent definitely. in hers bracelets if you wanted to, you know. Perfect. WPGP40 is your code 0800 655. You've got 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22. Sorry, Leah. 24. Yeah, about 48 gemstones. £3.45 pence for you. Oh, you might have to. I forgot to put my contact lens in. I might have to go and do it on the break. Oh, there we go. Uh, Kath. Oh, is it not? No, I've got an old one. Okay. Lynn in Northumberland. <laughs> yeah. Hi, Hannah, Katie, and the crew. What are those boulders on the tea bar? Show me, please. Lynn, you mean these? They're huge, aren't they? They're absolutely huge. Uh, those are coming up for you at 8 o'clock uh, this evening. Today's must have aqua quartzite. Huge selection of aqua quartzite. They're cool. I love those ones. Again, it's that regular shape. And those ones. Little, little pillows. Nuggets. Mm. Nuggets. I wouldn't call those nuggets. I had loads of visitors over Christmas. <laughs> Did you have any visitors over Christmas? Uh, no, Katie? not many. I went visiting. You went visiting. visiting. Yeah. See, there you go, Becky. Katie was a visitor. Producer yeah. Becky finds it highly hilarious that I say I have visitors. <laughs> you was a visitor. Yeah. Well, I'm. Oh, it was the way that I said it. <laughs> I've had visitors. I had visitors on Christmas Eve. Yeah. But then I was the visitor. Oh, yeah. I see. So you did lots of travelling yeah. around to visit everyone. Mm -hmm. I didn't. Everyone came to me. It's been non-stop for a week. <laughs> oh. I am. Well, today my plan was to uh, stay in my pyjamas all day because last night was the first night. Last night was the first night that um, we actually got the house to ourselves. Like, nobody was staying over. We didn't have to entertain. We didn't have to cook for everyone. It was the first night, so today I was like, right, tomorrow I'm not getting dressed all day. I'm not, I'm not getting, I'm not even going to have a wash. I'm going to eat my lunch. I'm going to eat my lunch in my pajamas. I know, this first thing producer Kim asked me, she's like, did you have a wash? <laughs> did have a shower. Um, but yeah, I was going to message Casey today to ask if she wanted to do a pajama show because I was really yeah, thinking about gutted it. Gutted you didn't. Absolutely gutted I know, you didn't. I know. Yeah. We should have, shouldn't we? Pajama show. Yeah, next time next time <laughs> Adam is anyway <laughs> um, right let's have a look at these oh <laughs> no I did wash today what I said was oh my plans were just to have a duvet day and that may have involved not even washing but it all changed Adam so don't worry uh, 150 carats of your burnt orange stripe agate plain rounds you've got here. Eight millimetres in size. That's a beautiful, beautiful hue you've got there. I know. They're amazing, aren't they? Um, that orange for me is quite close to Mexican fire opal. If you see Mexican fire opal of this hue, that really deep orange verging on that burnt red hue, 
you would be looking at a really, really high price tag. You know, that's the, that's the colour, the most desirable colour in your Mexican fire opal that really does push prices up. You know, for me, this is a great alternative. Quite often, here at Jewelry Maker, we do have these hues, but we have very little of it in strands, obviously because it's that, that, that premium price tag. We don't have a huge amount of it. Um, so for me, you know, your carnelians and gemstones like this are a great alternative. Um, you know, if your budget won't allow you to stretch perhaps to Mexican fire open, if this were 150 carats of Mexican fire open of this size, oh my gosh. Um, GIGP97 is your code, £2.95. That's less than your postage. £2.95. £2.95. Two ninety five. Surely that's a treat yourself price tag, isn't it? Two ninety five. Christmas cash. Did you get Christmas cash, Becky? A little bit of Christmas cash. Did you, Katie? A little bit. Yeah. Yeah. Did you, Adam? No. Neither did you, Leah. No Christmas cash. Yeah. Because I'm thinking it's the perfect time, isn't it? Off anyone. Christmas cash to get any of your parents, any family members. You know, a bit of Christmas cash. Partner. No. 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 I says who off? Who off? Yeah, it's nice to see it, Joy Maker. So she went to like two ninety five. Yeah, you know, just trip myself to a few gemstone strands. Righty ho. Oh, these are lovely. These definitely shouldn't be going under ten pounds. <gasps> wow. Look at these. You prefer a gift card, do you bet? Did you have a gift card then? Any vouchers? Did you? Did well there. The work one. The work one. It says Leah. Yeah, we got one. That's good. Uh, 300 carats of rose quartz plain tumbles you've got here. These are stunning. And this is textbook. I can't see the graphicals because I did forget to put my contact lens in, but I'm banking on the fact that these are Madagascan because they look it. Yes. Yeah. yes. We can confirm <laughs> uh, they are Madagascan. Um, Madagascan rose quartz, lots of us here at Jewelry Maker will tell you it is the cream of the crop, it really is. Look at that diaphanity, that inner glow that you've got there. That is absolutely textbook. That's beautiful. Really ethereal gemstone. Very calming as well, very much like your jadeite and your angelite. When you've got those gemstones with those um, pastel hues, it, you know, even if you are not somebody that particularly believes in the supposed healing properties of gemstones, I think there is um, something very, very calming um, about pastel hues in gemstones. You know, whether that be your jadeite or your angelite or your rose quartz, it's really, really tranquil, that hue. Huge, huge sizes, 11 by 10 to 20 by 12 millimetres in size 32 centimetre strands. You've got two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 21. That's ridiculous. Five pounds and 95 pence. And um, what would you do with a strand like this, Katie? Tumbles, like a regular shape? I think a few of them would have, be, have to be individual rings. Yeah. Because so, you get that beautiful glow. But also, I quite like them all together. Maybe you use some that black spinel space in between and just mm. make quite a long necklace, but just that front section nice. and have it quite heavy there. Yeah. yeah. That would look really, really pretty, wouldn't it? Do you know what I'm just looking? The, the chunkier gemstones, I think, I love, you know, I love a 30-inch chain with a, a big gemstone on the bottom, tassels on there as well. If you were selling something like that, you know, you'd get your money back, I don't know how many times over, just oh, for one gemstone. Yeah, easily. That's crazy, easily. isn't it? I mean, that gemstone by itself, that's got to be 20 carats, roundabouts. Five pounds and ninety-five pence. Oh, eight hundred six double four six double five. F Y I N sixty-three. That is your code for this one. Just make sure you're checking out if you have it in your basket. Remember, while you leave things in your basket, you haven't actually secured your purchase. It's all about confirmation. So please make sure you're confirming. Prices do go back up at eight a.m. in the morning. It doesn't matter how many times you're logging in and checking out. It doesn't matter how many times you're dialing in on the phone lines. It doesn't matter how many times you tap the app. You've only got one postage of just £3.95 in any one day. So please don't think that you're going to get charged more. You won't. <laughs> I hundred six triple four six. Have you broke the computer? Oh, she's just spilled a whole pint of gin. Unbelievable. <sighs> it's water, really. It's water. Right. Oh, speaking of Mexican fire opal, this is not, but again, perfect, perfect strand. 
Look at that. Wow. Um, you may remember, and this is going back some years now because we were in our old building. Um, guest designer Ginger Brunwell made the most incredible pair of um, ombre fire opal earrings using <gasps> nuggets with the Mexican fire opal. And they were just incredible. And it's one of those pieces of jewellery that has stuck in my mind for a very, very long time. I would love to recreate that look with these carnelian nuggets. They are beautiful. Two by one to nine by four millimetres in size. See, they're very autumnal, aren't they? It's the kind of colour you see in the autumn, but then it does remind me of summer as well. Yeah, I'm loving them with the turquoise colours we've got from the tea bar. <gasps> the, the quartz side. Ooh. Those together, that's very summer, isn't it? That's a holiday waiting to happen, that one. Look at those together, they look beautiful. 150 carats of your carnelian. Um, chips and nuggets are a great way to try a gemstone out, you know, um, before perhaps you buy the faceted rondelles or a gemstone strand that would um, perhaps come with a higher price tag because it's been faceted and graduated. These in nugget form, all we've done is literally cut them and give them a little polish. No fasting with these whatsoever. Uh, so you've got something that's very, very organic. In memory wire bracelets, they look incredible. In crochet, they look amazing as well. Lots of you that do your tree of life designs, perhaps it could be an autumnal tree of life. Perhaps it could be something for summer as well with that kind of sunset hue that you've got there. Three pounds and 95 pence. That's an 84 centimeter strand that you have there as well. It's essentially two strands. Right. Amethyst. <gasps> oh, do you know what? I, this to me has got first time buyer written all over it. Yes. It really has. This is such a versatile strand. And also it's amethyst. It's so, so popular. Um, amethyst is actually the most popular gemstone for all of our new viewers and all of our regulars here at Jewelry Maker. Um, it's always top of the pops. And I think it's just because it's so recognisable, isn't it? There really isn't anybody out there, maybe very few people, that are not sure what this gemstone is. It's something that is instantly recognisable. It's something that's freely available as well. It's one of those that you'll always kind of find on your high street, um, in your high street shops as well. And not always necessarily that pricey either, because it is a fairly abundant gemstone. We can get some great prices uh, for amethyst. However, um, you may have heard us say before that in our opinion, uh, in terms of locations, Zambian for us is the location. There's lots of gemstones out there whereby um, different locations will bring us like the best. Like with the rose quartz, for example, I said the Madagascar uh, rose quartz is, is the best in our opinion, which it is, you know, your Burmese sapphires, for example. With your amethyst, it's all about Zambia. Now at the bottom of your screen, it says Africa. We can assume this is Zambian because that's the only location we will get that from. Um, so this is Zambian. It's completely natural it has textbook color a real deep rich hue that you've got there so you have a gemstone that's incredibly incredibly popular you've got eight mil rounds as well so i'm thinking in terms of uh, starting out you've got gemstone that's really really popular and my eight mil round that's always going to be a stretchy for me that's my everyday piece of jewelry so you don't actually even need any tools all you need is your real stretchy elastic pair of scissors to cut the elastic. Um, take a length of your elastic, give it a little stretch out, take some of the elasticity out beforehand, then pop your gemstones on there. Just hold it up against the wrist until you've got the desired length and then you just tie a knot in your elastic. A little bit of glue on there, 24 hours drying time. That is it. And you'll get two of them from this one strand quite easily as well. Six pounds and 95 pence. I wanna build in the uh, building. <laughs> bring in the Thai Buddha oh, as well. Yeah, they work perfectly together, don't they? Wouldn't that be amazing yeah. as a gift? Actually, as a gift, six ninety-five. You're talking three pound fifty per bracelet because you'll get two bracelets from this strand. Nice little Buddha in there as well. How lovely would that be? Really pretty. I'll show you that very quickly. That pretty. Well done. Uh, it's February first, as well, which you know isn't too far away. Just around the corner. Um, which one? I, I might, oh, it's that one there. Yes, there we go. I have this. In fact, I have four of these. <laughs> that was my intention. Uh, Becky just asked if I stamped them. I did, in, I did intend, I had every intention. And uh, I haven't stamped them yet, but I do have four of these at home. Um, and the reason that I've got four is because of the price tag and also because it is such a popular motif. Like, you know, your stars, your hearts, um, 
your crosses, your feathers, your wings, they'll never ever date. Always really popular. And actually with Valentine's Day being the next big event on the calendar for all of us jewellery makers, it's only like six and a bit weeks away, I think. Yeah. Uh, so not long at all. And as jewellery makers, you've always got to be thinking of the next occasion. Yeah, you've got to you? think weeks, if not months ahead. Yeah, yeah definitely. And, and plan for them. And I love this as well because, it, you know, it is that heart motif, which is the ultimate symbol of love, if you like. But also, this is something that we can personalise for our customers as well. So, you know, if you have got a craft fair coming up, perhaps you could have these as, as they are um, on your craft stall and then offer that service, that stamping service, as an extra, that personalisation. It could be a date, it could be a name, it could be a quote that you're popping on there is a big surface area to cover. Uh, Becky was just saying actually that, that stamping is quite difficult. It is. Practice first on your plated, um, on your plated or your, um, you know, the, the just like the, like the sheets yeah. and stuff like that that we have and the, the, yeah. the brass um, blanking stamps and things like that. I did it. So I had uh, producer Kim and producer Phil got married and They've got this thing about fish. <laughs> and it just so happens that we had... I don't, know what it is. <laughs> don't ask anymore. Um, it just so happens that we had a 925 sterling silver fish, just like this, stamping blank. And I thought, right, that's it. When I buy their bottle of bubbles as their wedding present, I'm going to do something, uh, put something around the top, maybe their birthstones, and then put this fish on, and I'm going to stamp Finn on the fish. Phil and Kim, Finn. Um, and I practised three times on my copper blanks first. Perfect every single time. Got to the sterling silver one, got to the sterling silver one, first three letters, perfect, last letter, moved. Ruined it, ruined it, ruined it, couldn't do it. I know, I did a cry. <laughs> I know, but it does, it, you know what, it does take practice. It is, I think sometimes, I think sometimes when you overthink things. Yeah, I think you need to kind of just get into a zone and get quite relaxed yeah. over it rather than thinking, oh, it's got to, you know. It's got to yeah. be, yeah, because yeah. I think with the, with, the, um, with the brass ones, I perhaps just went, yeah, 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 yeah. Did, you know, just yeah, did really more think relaxed about it. And that. then with the yeah. sterling silver one, I was quite nervous about doing it, and I think that's maybe how I fluffed it up. Um, but it does, it does require practice. But you can, you can stamp on these, you can engrave on them as well, uh, if you want to. In fact... You could just glue a cabochon on there if you wanted to as well. Four pounds and ninety-five pence. R M R F one four is your code for this one. You have two point four grams of ninety-five sterling silver. That's a precious metal that's going to really withstand the test of time. If you have got, you know, uh, any gifts for Valentine's Day, if you want this to be a necklace or a charm, it could be a back charm, it could be uh, in a necklace design, you could multi-buy and have the earrings, you could have the sweet if you wanted to. Or if you did want to pop it around a bottle of bubbles or something like that, uh, a special glass that you've had engraved, uh, you could have that as a wine glass charm. There's so many different ways in which you can use them, isn't yeah, there? Definitely, definitely. You could even hot fix onto that as well. Can you imagine? Yeah. Bling it up. That would look amazing, wouldn't it? Four pounds and ninety-five pence. Well done if you managed to get that one. Right, it's time for Star Boy. <laughs> Amethyst. This is this is this has to be Zambian. It has to be the depth of colour, the sumptuousness in this. It's like it reminds me of those little um, blackberries off that juice advert. It's almost, it almost makes your mouth water. They're so juicy. They really, really are vibrant. Um, rondelles, you know, I've always, always thought about using these as spacers because they have a flat side and a faceted edge to them. They will sit in between other gemstones perfectly. Um, and also channel setting, they're brilliant for channel setting. But I think it was a good few weeks ago now. Um, I think it was Deborah, it was either Deborah or Alison Terry that said about channel, uh, sorry, not channel setting, um, about Rosary Lincoln with these. And I just Wow, yeah. I've, I don't think I've ever seen a Rondell Strand rosary link no, before. No, I don't think I've ever done one. But I think it would that look was, amazing. Yeah. It really we used to sell delicate. the kind of tiny ones, didn't we? Yeah. But with that size, it'd look absolutely amazing. Yeah, I think it would look really, really pretty, especially with something like your copper-coloured wire as well. Um, it would really, really complement these 
they are Zambian as well. Natural, 100% natural. That is exactly the colour that Mother Nature intended these to be. They really are textbook amethysts that you've got here. Um, if you are thinking of doing any birthstone pieces, now's a really good time to start thinking about it because January is only days away now. Um, it seems like it's the last day of December tomorrow, isn't it? It's 31st. It is. What happened to Christmas? Where's Christmas It went gone? too far. Didn't it just? Far too fast. It went so quickly. I do literally spend from July to December getting so excited. Yes. And then on the day, I'm like, I can't believe it's Christmas. And then on Boxing Day, I'm like, I can't believe it's over. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so British. It's unbelievable. <laughs> uh, 56 carats of your amethyst you've got there in your rondelles. Oh, 800, six triple four, six double five. It should be £11.95. pence. However, uh, we're in under £10 hour, so you know what that means. You're not going to be paying any more than £9.95. One postage in any one day as well. So from midnight last night right through until midnight tonight, just one postage of £3.95. £6.95. That is pretty much close to half price, isn't it? We were at £12 before. We're at £7 now. That's brilliant, isn't it? Absolutely fantastic. If you are thinking of trying this out, do it. It's a free telephone number. Give the call centre a ring. They'll set up your account. It only takes a couple of minutes. It doesn't take very long at all. Uh, they'll take a few details from you. Thereafter, when you call in, all you need to do is give them your postcode, your account number, or your name, um, and they can add to your order so quickly. You will get two Genuine Gemstone strands free of charge with your very first purchase as well. And they could be anything. We were talking about this yesterday because we did have some messages in, uh, not on my show, but on someone else's show uh, a while ago. Somebody had, somebody's had Tanzanite. We've had a sapphire confirmation. Malachite as well. So it could be anything. So don't just assume, it, yeah, it's going to be quartz or, you know, one of the more abundant gemstones and more affordable. Not the case. It's completely random. N-I-R-U-1-0. Well done. Uh, amber. Oh. <gasps> Look at the size of this as well. Wow. Look at the size of this. This is huge. Now, amber isn't measured in carat weight because it's the least dense, uh, so the least dense gemstone of them all. It's not measured in carat weight, it's measured in size. So this one, 25 by 14 millimeters in size, that is a whopper. It's huge, isn't it? Now, you've got two drill holes with this, which is fantastic. Straight away for me, I'm thinking, in a bracelet design. Yeah, absolutely. On the wrist. Yeah. As it's, a statement. Yeah, you imagine it, that on the flex right. Oh, amazing. That would look gorgeous, wouldn't it? If you use your flex right with that, it would look stunning. Yeah, I'd be tempted um, to go with wire work and then have a really beautiful weave around each side. That would look nice, yeah. isn't it? Quite ornate. Yeah, definitely. It's such a beautiful gem, it really is. Now, no two will be the same. Uh, it is a gem whereby um, you will have those inclusions there. Um, sometimes you don't, to be perfectly honest, sometimes you don't. Uh, for me, personally, I want inclusions in my amber. If I see something that has no inclusions whatsoever that has the name amber next to it, I'm, I will question the authenticity of it because, generally speaking, uh, you do get those inclusions there. It basically was for millions and millions of years ago from fossilised tree sap. So the tree would produce a sticky substance to protect the bark of the tree. Um, and because it was a sticky substance, lots of insects and creatures would get trapped inside. And then over time, over the millions of years, due to heat and pressure and all of the elements, um, it solidified. And that is what has given us this incredible, incredible gem. Now, if you go into, um, you know, like your uh, silver boutiques and you see side shops, as I call them, this always stands out as being very, very pricey to me, Amber. It's really, really sought after in the gem world. And do you know what? There isn't anything else like it, is there? It really is a standalone gem. Absolutely beautiful. Um, regarding myth and folklore and legend with this one, there is a lot to be said. It has been used for medicinal purposes for centuries. Now, when worn against the skin, it is said to release... <laughs> I always forget this. It's something that sounds a bit like succinct, succinct, succinct. It begins with an S and it's definitely got the sin and the tint 
in there somewhere. But basically, that is an anti-inflammatory, <coughs> excuse me, that it is said to release, which is why a lot of parents use it for teething as well. So if you've ever seen a toddler wearing an amber necklace and you're thinking, oh my gosh, <laughs> that toddler's been brought up to be a right princess. <laughs> Tell me at the age of two. It's not, it's for teething. So it is said to help. Whether or not that, that works, I don't know. I'm on the fence with uh, the supposing healing properties of gemstones, but it has been used uh, for many, many years uh, for medicinal purposes. But if you do type it into a search engine, there is a lot of myth and folklore and legend about this gem. It does actually create static electricity as well uh, when worn against the skin, so you can feel the warmth from it. But because of that, hundreds of years ago, it was once believed to create actual magic. I love that. Uh, 25 by 14 millimeters in size. I'll just pop it on the wrist so you can see that for size. If you were just to pop, in fact the drill holes are quite sizable on there. Uh, you flex right through there or your wire, however you want to put that, maybe onto some bare copper or yeah. something like that. Just see now amazing. I'm thinking maybe on a necklace and use one hole just for like the necklace yeah. part and then using the other hole to maybe make some sort of seed bead design sort of draped from the bottom Ooh, of it. That would be quite nice. Very but different. Nice. That would look gorgeous, wouldn't it? DDDY43. This has gone under £10. £9.95 for a piece of amber this size. I'm always saying it, it, it's a must. If you ever get the chance to go to the Natural History Museum in London, go and have a look at the gemstones because the amber samples that they have there are some of the most spectacular um, I think I've ever seen. And they've got over 3,000 gemstones in the Natural History Museum in London. So do go and have a look if ever you get the chance. DGGY43 is your code for that one. 0800 644 655. And we have had pieces here at Jewelry Maker whereby we've guaranteed an insect in your amber. We've actually bought a parcel um, because it's a big, big feature to get something that potentially is now extinct. Um, but the other day we did have some that, you know, we weren't guaranteeing them at all, but I did have a little ant, tiny little ant in the amber that I had as well. So you may find something in there. Uh, you may not. I like it. Right. <laughs> Oh, look at these like little bubbles. Little bubbles. These are very, very pretty. Um, I haven't seen for a very long time here at Joy Maker, but there was a time where we used to have the multicoloured elastics. Um, if you've got those in your stash, they're great. Brilliant. Really, really fantastic for making stretches with, especially when you've got a clear gemstone. If you were, in fact, it can just be, um, you know, a multicoloured thread, in fact, not just the elastic, but if you run any kind of coloured thread uh, through your clear gemstone, it almost magnifies the colour for you. So it really does give it a pop of colour and makes it a really, really fun design as well. Um, six millimetres in size in your clear quartz, you've got eight carats, sorry, 80 carats in total there. Now, six mil rounds or six mil size, I should say, we refer to as the desert island size here at Joymaker. And the reason being is because you can incorporate a six mil round into pretty much every medium that we bring you. You know, whether you are a wire worker, um, a chain mailer, somebody that works with ceruloons or clays, if you are uh, somebody that seed beads, uses macrame or kimihimo, you can incorporate them into your design. So again, it really is a great strand for new viewers to come in for. You've got something that is a clear gemstone. So in terms of, of putting this with other things, it will go with everything absolutely anything and everything from your different colored gemstones through to your different colored threads through to your different colored threading materials and findings it will really work and you know what that holds so much light as well it's really going to add brightness to a gemstone to a uh, design i should say i am gp35 is your code five pounds and 95 pence uh, you have Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty, twenty four, twenty six, twenty eight, thirty. 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, 42, 44, 46, 48, 50, 52, 54, 56, 48, 60, 62, 64, 66, 68, 70. Actually, forgot what came after 68 then. Unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs> I am TB. <laughs> Uh, 35, 8 pence each. So you're talking um, 16 pence to make a pair of earrings. Wow. You, can, that, like, you can't even get costumed. Obviously, you've got the cost of your findings as well, but yeah, that's going to be pennies. Yeah. You just can't buy... You can't even buy costume jewellery for those kind of prices anyway. No Never way. mind genuine gemstone no jewellery. Right. Like I said, these go with everything. Yeah. Absolutely. And another great one for anybody that hasn't bought from us before... 
I would definitely be buying this strand and the amethyst strand that we've just had as well. They'd look amazing, They'd look amazing together, together, wouldn't together. they? Really pretty. Uh, five pounds and ninety-five pence. Just make sure you're confirming and checking out as soon as you possibly can. Um, one more auction away from the Buddhas. They are. They're going to fly. They'll be so popular. I love those. Right. Pico. Tiger's eye. Oh my gosh. Do you know what? I'm going to get this strand. <laughs> Yes, I am. I am, Becky, because I love this gemstone so much. I've got one strand of tiger's eye in my stash, and it's one that I need more of. I love it so much. Um, it's always on the catwalk at Fashion Week, and, you know, I always watch Fashion Week. I always watch some footage and, and obviously do some research uh, because it is important in this industry that we do follow fashion as well. Um, and tiger's eye is always, always, always on the catwalk. It's massive, this gemstone. And do you know what? The other week I was reading, um, uh, just it just happened to be one of those magazines, Hello, OK, whichever one it was. And there was a big article in there about gemstones and the supposed healing properties of gemstones and all these different celebrities. Um, and it had a list of gemstones next to them. And it was like, you know, Adele uses black obsidian for this and Jasper for this and Victoria Beckham uses this for that and this for that. It was really, really interesting. But Tiger's Eye w was really, really really um, uh, popular in the article. Lots of people used it for its healing properties. Um, again, not something we can go massively into, but lots of uh, celebrities wearing and using this gemstone as well. Kate Moss, I've said many times before, can be seen. You know, if you, if you just type it into images on, on a search engine, there's so many pictures you can find where she's wearing tiger's eye necklaces, earrings, rings, or whatever. It's a really, really popular gemstone. The size of these, the carat weight that you have, the quality, they're going under 10. They're going under 10 pounds. 360 carats of tiger's eye rings. Ring, I would just, the, the most fabulous statement ring with this. Oh, yeah. Yeah, don't cover it up too much. Just keep it yeah. really open so you can oh, see you all that useful gemstone. It's the perfect size as well, isn't it, I think, for a statement ring. It's one of those that has that phenomenon, that chatoyancy there. So it's very, very appealing to lots of gem collectors. But for those people that are not familiar with the gemstone, it really catches your eye. It's really quite mesmerising and hypnotic, that chatoyancy within the gemstone. Caused by silk-like inclusions, gives you that uh, illusion, if you like, of the opening and closing of an eye, hence the name uh, Tiger's Eye. And for me, I mean, I do love all the dyed Tiger's Eye and the different colours that we can get, but the natural yellow Tiger's Eye for me is definitely my favourite. And I think it's a unisex gemstone, so I like quite unisex Absolutely. One. Perfect, isn't it? Yeah, in the middle of like a gents again, a macrame bracelet, or just simply popping it onto like uh, some of the natural hemp cords, or you know, some of the natural coloured um, eslons that we have here at Jewelry Maker. I think it would look lovely. Now you have two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen individual gemstones on this strand. Earrings, that'd be great for earrings. Yeah, as well. just really simple pendants, just yeah. literally just on a piece of wire, pop a little swirl on one end, and just push mm. it over the bottom of the gemstone, then wrap loop on the top. Really, really nice, simple, reversible pendant. And you could do that. So, did I count 18? I've forgotten already. I think I counted 18. <laughs> Recount. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16. 16 gemstones, £8.95. and pence. That is just 55 pennies per gemstone for you today. And I mean, how much How much do you think you'd sell one of those for, Katie? If you did, you know, your ring or the pendant uh, or... So a really simple pendant, probably about £18, something like that. Just with, with a plated wire, yeah. Yeah, and that's one gemstone. Yeah. And you're doubling your money, you know? It's just brilliant, isn't it? Uh, Zedu, GP81 is your code. Oh, 800 Of course, you know, we always throw prices out there when it comes to selling. I don't sell, personally. Actually, I do, really. I've sold a couple of pieces, but only on auction websites. It's not a regular thing. But um, when I throw prices out there, it's purely uh, speaking from my experience in the industry my research into gemstones and um, you can price them wherever you like you know if you think where i've gone is way too high and um, then obviously feel free to put a much lower price tag on but just remember with genuine gemstones if prices are too low you will get those people that doubt the authenticity of the gemstone if you've got your certificate of authenticity don't worry it's an extra 25 pence to add to your order or you can print it off free of charge at the web 
always have that to back you up there if you do like to pass on those deals. Uh, right, it's time for a star buy. The last time I had um, anything like this was probably, I'm going to say, eight months ago, maybe even more. And um, they were sterling silver, so obviously they were um, uh, higher in price. But it was, it was like a little promo that we did to um, promote the, the forthcoming 95 sterling silver weekend that we had. And it, it is like on, you know, on our data and analysis and figures and things, it's one of those auctions that was right at the top for being one of the quickest sellouts we'd ever had here at Joymaker. Um, the budders are always, always massively, massively popular. Now, these are base metal, um, so they will be even more affordable for you and they are oh, do you know i think it's one of those motifs again that's just never going to date is it you know no, no it's always going to be it's yeah. always going to be popular definitely um obviously you know we can associate them with religion and faith but also um it is again um quite um what's the word i'm looking for it, it's there it's there in the in the fashion industry you know when you look at uh, lots of like madonna i know has um like a, a tibetan style break like stack yeah. of bracelets with with you know little buddha charms and things like that there's a lot of celebrities that was same kind of yeah. Piece. yeah 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 definitely um lots of them that wear these kind of things as well so it's you know it's, it is really at the forefront of fashion um as well as, as being worn for uh, religious and and faith reasons as well you will get a pack of 10. they're brand new and we only have just over a hundred, okay? Um, they will all go very, very quickly. So basically, whenever we bring any auction to you here at Jewelry Maker, as soon as the graphics come in, those of you that are shopping on the web can see a price tag. Sometimes it's the final or closing price tag, sometimes it's not and we go even lower. So you have a little bit of an advantage there whereby you can just quickly put it in your basket and check out. Telephone bidders, a lot of the time, wait for the graphics to come in, then wait a little bit longer. Then maybe think, do you know what, I might just dial now. Some of you wait until the price comes in, then you dial, then you listen to your automated message, then you get to speak to the call centre. By the time you've dialed, sometimes you're already in a queue. So what we like to do sometimes in auctions like this that we know are going to be hugely popular, we like to give you all the same opportunity. We want it, we want it to be completely fair with this. So what we're, what we're doing is letting the telephone bidders get ready, get your phones ready, I always say I have us on speed dial, but that's such a 90s thing, isn't it? Like, <laughs> Becky doesn't even know what speed dial is. She's so young. <laughs> I don't think anyone does, but you just say it anyway, Leah. Um, because obviously on your mobile, it's just saved in your memory. So it's like, I guess that is like what speed dial yeah, was, isn't it? Thing, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. It just used to be a memory on your landline, but you would be like, you could only save like three numbers yeah. or something. <laughs> you have to have a favourite. Um, but yeah. Get ready, get your mobiles ready, get your landlines ready. In fact, we'll let you dial. Just have a chat with the call centre. Talk about Christmas. Talk about food. <laughs> Do you know what? I think even I'm fed up of food now. You're not, are you not, Leah? I think I'm done with the crisps and the twiglets and the chocolates and the leftovers. And... Anyway, sorry, Adam's like, ah, uh, can we start the clock? <laughs> we can't do anything until we start the clock. So we'll start the clock and we'll talk about twiglets for a minute. Yeah, I don't, I, don't, I don't actually like them. In fact, not many people do, so there's lots of them left over. You like them. Oh, I should bring those in as well, shouldn't I then? Yeah. Where do you stand on the twiglets? No. No, see. No. <laughs> are, are they Marmite flavoured? Yeah. They are. That's... So this is why it's a love-hate thing then. No, it's a hate. Yeah, me too. Can't do them. No. Can't do them. No. Um, so... <laughs> Um, get your phones ready, speak to the cousin about food, Christmas, the new year, the weather, whatever you want to. Um, and as soon as those graphics are in, the call centre can then allocate to your order for you, okay? 15 seconds approximately is all you have left. <laughs> I'm injured. Six double four, six double five. I have four budders in my garden. Yeah, four. 
I love them. I love the ornamental ones. Yeah. See, I bet a lot of you have them without even realising you have them. Really, even though they like, if they've been bought for you as gifts and stuff, and you kind of just put it. In I think it might have disappeared. If something's grown over it now. Oh, I did actually not find off one of them as well. <laughs> she fell over. She fell over in the storms. Her head fell off. I don't know. I got. I got. I'm not. I, well, I don't think I'm superstitious. But at that point, I did get very superstitious. I was like, hang on a minute. Is this bad yeah. luck? I don't know. <laughs> But yeah, four buddhas just in the garden. I really like them in pictures, and yeah. I think it kind of brings a sense of peace. Oh, I've got three buddha like, pictures, yeah. I've got lots of bracelets. See, look, there you yeah. go, there you go. Uh, ten pieces, silver plated base metal you have here. Now, in size, they are 19 by 10 millimetres. So if I just take which one? Do you know what? I'm going to take the amethyst because I think, <laughs> I think this would be. Perfect strand for a stretchy, and I also think this is the perfect size charm for a stretchy. So you've got a really good idea um, of size. So that's an eight mil round that you've got there. Compared with an eight mil round, that's like perfect. Yeah, that's the perfect in, balance, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. And you know, even if you have them on your craft stall and just sell them individually as an extra to add into jewellery, whether it be a pair of earrings, you can have one on a pendant if you want to. It says charms, but you can wear them however you want to. Um, just sell them as they are. They will be hugely, hugely popular. And I have a feeling it's going to be one of those that if you only buy one pack, when you've sold all ten, you'll be thinking, oh. I, I think these all. would sell great just to just pop them straight on the smearing findings. Yeah. Just a pair of earrings. Definitely. Yeah. They're just so popular, aren't they? Bag charm. You can yeah. have them as bag charms. You know, if you've got a little clutch bag that's taken out tomorrow night, not that you have them in time for tomorrow, but you know. Um, OB, GP80, Mazza in Greater Manchester, Mary in Worcestershire, Arlene in Greater London, Janet and John, Sarah's got two, Fiona, they're all there, Rosalind, Wendy, Collector, Sylvia, John, Eva, congratulations to you. Uh, Marion, you've just got yours as well. Elizabeth there, Margaret, congratulations. Uh, Debbie, you've just checked yours out as well. Done Anne on the phone lines. Heather's just come in. Catherine, collect in Bridge End. You've just checked yours out. There's absolutely tons and tons of you coming in for these. Just make sure that you check out as soon as you possibly can. As soon as you possibly can, you have them home in a couple of days' time. 0800 644 655. You've got 30 day money back guarantee if you want to get them home. You want to have a look at the quality. You want to see the size of them, perhaps next to a strand or a stretcher that you're already wearing. Actually, they would look great, perfect with jadeite. Oh, amazing! Yeah, one of yeah. my brothers is, is on a on a jadeite bracelet. You do yeah. see a lot of um, uh, carvings where yes. where brothers have been carved yeah. from jadeite, yeah, don't you? you do. As well, um, I did once see one on. I think it was the Antiques Roadshow. I watch Antiques Roadshow and vlog it and all of those when I can specifically for jewellery um and there was a there was a buddha on one of those literally it's only about six inches high carved from jadeite and it was valued at twenty six thousand pounds can you imagine the gallery kind of that <laughs> oh my gosh i know i know imagine having that sat in your attic it was me uh catherine in lanarkshire margaret in berkshire collector sarah in east yorkshire wendy's there collector in northamptonshire collector in the west midlands uh congratulations bridget you've just checked yours out yvonne sandra's there diana congratulations to you claire freddie congratulations you've just checked out as well there are approximately 50 in baskets at this moment in time now we only had i think 101 or 103 or something like that um 101 that's all we had literally getting on for half of the stock has gone we are over allocated at this moment in time but please don't think on the telephone lines that you haven't got a chance to do it you wouldn't believe how many people sit there with things <coughs> in their baskets and don't check out i know um, it would also look great with a kyanite oh i i've seen this strand have you seen this strand becky this is the bluest, bluest kyanite I have ever, ever seen. Look at these. In fact, so much so, I can remember the first time I had it, I didn't even, I didn't think it was the right strand because it's so blue. Isn't that amazing? That's coming up for you after the break before the kit as well. Um, Barbara, Patricia, Sarah, Wendy, Collector, John, Eva, Adele in Surrey. Congratulations to you. You've just checked out as well. Uh, Marion, you're there. Isabel, you're there. Congratulations. Claire's there. Susanna, congratulations. Collector, there's so many of you coming through on the phone lines. Philip has just checked out as well. Tina, congratulations. Uh, Lisa's there. Wendy, well done to you. Betty, congratulations. <laughs> Six pounds. Did you forget that? Did you forgot she's fallen asleep? Six ninety-five. 
Six pounds. You can't rush these things. Six pounds. She likes to keep you on the edge. Six pounds. Or sometimes she just moves on with no price and just lets you guess the price. <laughs> Yeah. Um, massive congratulations. Six ninety five. That works out to just sixty nine pennies. Whoopsie. At sixty nine pennies per charm. How much do you think you could sell those at, Casey? Like just as they are, just not as, in jewellery, but just, just as, as they, they are. are. About a fiver each. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I think that yeah, would be a great. Yeah, a copper jump ring on and just sell it as a as a charm to add yeah, onto yeah. your own bracelet. That's brilliant, isn't yeah. it? Six nice, six and nine pence cost, fantastic. Um, just to say, if you do have those in your basket, you are very close to missing out. So please, please make sure that you check out as soon as you possibly can for those. If you've got a phone in your hand right now, just sit tight. Stay exactly where you are and make sure that you speak to the call centre. Um, coming up for you in the next hour, I have this kyanite strand that is just unbelievable so so blue and um, i've got the kit coming up for you as well and i've got an amazing amazing selection of your bronzite coming up as well so lots more still to come uh, please don't go anywhere get yourself a fresh cuppa i'll meet you back here in just a couple of minutes time see you watch us on freeview we have some very exciting news to share with you. From Monday the 7th of January 2019, Jewelry Maker will be on Freeview HD 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Please be aware that if you have an HD Freeview TV, you'll need to retune from 1pm on the 7th to take advantage of this, to ensure you don't miss out on any jewelry making goodies. If you're in an area that doesn't have HD coverage, but you have a connected TV, don't panic. You can still watch JM by going to channel 73, where you'll find our sister channel, Sewing Quarter. Simply click on the red button, and this will give you the option to watch JM all day. Don't forget, you can also view Jewelry Maker on Sky, Virgin, Freesat, and the fastest way to shop with us is online at jewelrymaker.com. Or download the Jewelry Maker app. Tune in from Monday the 7th of January for 24 hours of Jewelry Maker on Freeview HD. Our brand new Get Started with Jewellery Maker page has been created to provide help and guidance for jewellery making newbies. If you need design suggestions, hints and tips, or help with perfecting your jewellery designs, we're here to help. Head over to facebook.com slash getstartedwithjm where our talented in-house designers are happy to answer your jewellery making questions, offer inspiration and get you started in your jewellery making journey. Jewellery Maker. Create. Wear. Share. If you have a question or a query for Jewelry Maker, then you can contact our call centre on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Or alternatively, you can email help at jewelrymaker.com. Love Jewelry Maker but don't have an account? You can now purchase items on the Jewelry Maker website through our guest checkout. To do so, select the products you wish to purchase and head over to the shopping basket. Simply enter your email address and select continue as guest below. After this, the checkout process is simple. Select your quantity and delivery option and then check out securely. Enter your billing details and either a credit card or PayPal account and proceed to payment. From here, you still have the option to create an account if you wish, making shopping online easier for you. Jewelry Maker, create, wear, share. At Jewelry Maker, we are always looking at ways to provide you with a fantastic shopping experience. With this in mind, we'd like to welcome you to our new pre-order option. Selected items throughout the day will be put on display and made available for pre-order. When the presenter informs you that the pre-order service is available on an item, this is your chance to pop it into your online basket or speak to one of our brilliant call centre team members and be one of the first to secure your purchase. Are you new to Jewelry Maker? For a limited time, we're offering new customers a wonderful free gift. The free gift includes two beautiful genuine gemstone strands in an organza bag. As long as you qualify as a new customer and haven't shopped with us before, then your free gift will be automatically added to your order when you make your first purchase. It's really that simple. Gemstone strands are selected at random, so gemstone size, color, and type will vary for each new customer. Why stop there? Once you receive your gemstones, we'd love to see what you create. 
Share your designs with us via our Facebook page and join our creative community of jewellery makers. Start your jewellery making journey with us today. Create. Wear. Share. I'm going to be completely honest with you, Ab like 100%. This happens a lot, don't worry. Um, right as we were coming back then, we had like three seconds. Adam, director, Adam being very professional. Five, four, three. I said, Becky, 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 can you tell me as soon as possible if this is treated, please, because I don't think it is. <laughs> it's natural. I'm not even joking. I am not even joking. That is hands down the bluest. And you know what? I shouldn't really doubt it, but you have to check because this is really important. That is the bluest kyanite I have ever seen. Anywhere, not just here at Jewel Maker, the bluest kyanite I have ever seen. I have to have this strand. I have to have it. This is my favourite. Look how blue! It's like... It looks like lapis. It it's like... It's that intense. That's Absolutely beautiful. Just like... I've never seen Kai and I... I, I just cannot believe that that is natural. This is... See how... I've said it many, many times before, but... Our parcels, our gemstones, just keep getting better and better and better. Our buying team are becoming more and more particular, more and more fussy about what we're buying. This is brilliant for us uh, as gem collectors because you know, you're getting some of the most fantastic quality we've ever had in the history of jewellery maker. This is breathtaking. You have the most incredible, incredible blue hue and this is 100% natural. And you've got that textbook silvery, silky luster as well. I love that. It almost, almost makes me think of the moon more than moonstone does because of that luster that you have from this gemstone. It's just, it just reminds me of the moon. It's a real glow um, that you have from the surface of your kyanite here. It's just, I've just never seen anything like it. And the fact that these are five millimetres in size as well, I think is an absolute luxury. So pretty standardly, in terms of rounds, uh, here at Jewelry Maker, we bring you, uh, you know, your four mil rounds, your six mil rounds, your eight mil rounds. Um, but five mil, it's really nice to have that different size. You know, it might be that you've got an absolute stash full of five millimeter spacer beads. Yeah. And, you know, you are that person that wants consistency in your designs. Um, you are somebody that likes everything perfectly symmetrical and, and just as. You know, you might be waiting for that five mil gemstone to come along for whatever reason. This is your gemstone. This is so rare and so, so collectible and the best colour I've ever seen in a strand. Um, five millimetres in size. I would put this up there with your six mil desert island size. You know, there's only a millimetre in it. You are going to be able to use this across every medium here at Jewelry Maker, in your macrame, in your kumihimo, in your wire work, in with your seed beads. It's like, imagine using this thing with shibori. Oh, beautiful with shibori. Oh, it looks it's stunning. stunning. Yeah, but, yeah, it would look so beautiful. XTKY18. Now, on the back of me doubting that this was natural, I would get your certificate of authenticity with this because you are going to own natural kyanite of this colour. Get your certificate of authenticity um, so that you can show your customers as well that we really are giving you the cream of the crop and you, you, you mean business <laughs> with this strand. <laughs> kyanite is not freely available. I've never, you know, I've never seen kyanite anywhere, and I know it will be there, obviously. Um, I don't think we'll find it on our high street. Um, I think you're going to have to go more boutique, more specialist jewellers. And, you know, if we go for those jewellers, we're always going to be paying a premium. We know that already. To be able to get 90 carats um, in one strand, in one go, is just 
amazing. Now I'm going to count them out so that we can work the individual carat weight out on these. You've got 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, 42, 44, 46, 48, 50, 52, 54, 56, 58, 60, 62, 64, 66, 68, 70, 72, 74, 76, 78. Wow. Whoa. 78. What would you do with them, Katie? I'd be tempted to channel set them into a sterling silver oh bracelet. Gosh, it's amazing. a beautiful size for it to be channel set. Yeah. Yeah, because it's going to have that statement because it's a 5 mil. Because I would normally channel set maybe with a 4 mil, but yeah. that's just going to give it that extra statement and just mm -hmm. really, really simply sterling silver. Like a nice cuff style bracelet. Oh, it look phenomenal, wouldn't it? Just, and I think, you know. For me personally uh, as well, that, that would have to be a minimum of 925 sterling silver. Yeah. I couldn't set that in anything less. Uh, or again, the rosary linking. Imagine that rosary oh link. Amazing. It would look stunning. Again, it? it would have to be sterling silver. Yeah, definitely. Um, get your certificate of authenticity. Remember, you've got a 30 day money back guarantee as well. If you want to get this home, you want to have a look at it. You want to have a close look. You want to see it in natural daylight as well. Um, natural daylight is the best possible light to view your gemstones in. Uh, and rumour has it, it is morning northern light specifically as well um but just view it in natural day in fact you know view it in natural daylight but view it in lots of different lighting conditions it's amazing at how many gemstones um come to life at night time as well you know we don't very often talk or think about viewing our gemstones at night time but if you do get a clear night with the moonlight view your gemstone at night time as well labradorite and moonstone in particular are great for that uh so everyone so far is checking out at 39 that's that's an amazing price wow. i have a feeling we're going lower and i genuinely 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 thought this would finish at 69.95 because it's natural i was thinking 59.95 to finish yeah i have a five mil strand oh that is from jiramaker and that color is out of this world compared to it and i thought I, mine was a great color do you know just from this out you've it's almost like an asterism that yes. you've got in it's almost like a star that i'm seeing in some of these gemstones there that's amazing in fact let me show you actually and i'm just going to do it the way as well i've got the rough kind of, it was definitely here the other day has it gone is it lost amongst the foliage it was it was on this shelf today because i literally only showed it a couple of here. days ago is it there is it hiding um, so we've got the rough kyanite um, now this gemstone is incredibly incredibly difficult to cut because of the way it forms so if you have a look at this rough crystal here this is an even gemstone quality um, that we're looking at here but can you see uh, i'll show you on this one here can you see all of those layers in, can you imagine? So as soon as you start cutting, the potential of other layers fracturing is huge. It requires the most skilled lapidris in the world to cut this gemstone. It's a really, really difficult gemstone to cut because of the way that it forms there with all those layers. The, 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 I can't even begin to imagine. Like, I them, you must require such skill. It must be about the angle, the speed, the tension. It's so important uh, when cutting this gemstone. I can't even begin to imagine how long it took to, to do that entire strand there. That's fantastic. It's phenomenal, that is. Um, we're at 39.95, and there are so many of you that have checked out at that price tag. Nobody pays any more than anybody else. You will all only ever pay the final low closing price tag. We're going even lower. XTKY18. I had a feeling that price was on its way. £29.95 wow. for natural kyanite of this colour. I couldn't sell this, Katie. No, that would absolutely be for, for, my, for my own collection. Yeah, definitely. It would be for me as well. I couldn't part with them. 131 chances. Half of the stock has already gone. You need to be really, really quick to check these out. 0800 644 655. This should be, in my opinion, 69.95 all day, 
every day, but £29.95 is an absolute giveaway. Angeline, Zoe, Cheryl and Morgan, collector in Cornwall. Joy Merseyside, Wendy in Flintshire. Julie in West Midlands, collector in Greater London. Claire's there, Hilma, Catherine. Pembrokeshire, how are you, lovely? Uh, Collect in Glamorgan, you're there as well, West Midlands, uh, Greater London, Essex, Hampshire, congratulations, Collect, you're there, West Midlands, Devon, you've just got yours, uh, Powish, you're there, Gwyneth, congratulations, Cardiff, you've just managed to get yours as well, uh, Flintshire, you've just checked out, that's lots of well, she's in tonight, uh, Carolyn Perth and Kim Ross, you've just managed to get yours on the telephone lines as well. At Glasgow, you've just managed to get yours as well. My goodness me, up and down the country, amazing, isn't it? 0800 If you have a phone in your hand, just make sure you confirm as soon as you can. And those of you with these in baskets, you have got to check this out. 30 day money back guarantee. I can't, n none oh, of these are coming back. No. None of these Not are coming back. No way. No quibble. Money back guarantee. Oh, I need one of those budders. I need to put the budder back on there. Oh, with the budder, yes. That's perfect. And is it, again, Kate, this is great for the gents as well, isn't it? Yeah. Really great unisex uh, gemstone you've got there. Fabulous size earrings, bracelets, pendants, beady beads with these as well. Perfect for incorporating into macrame designs. Kumihimo, 45 in baskets. Check out, <laughs> check out, check out. If you are sat there thinking about it, I'm not sure, I'm not sure. Get it home. Genuinely get it home and have a closer look at this. You're going to absolutely love it. 29.95, 0800, 644, 655. Um, now, nearly up to 50 in baskets. A massive, massive well done if you've managed to check yours out. Um, well done. Uh, 0800, 644, 655, XT, KY18. I love that. I'm going to have to get that. Yeah. Blue with them, blue. Oh, that was the Buddha. <laughs> now, this kit. Um, this gemstone has been nominated for gemstone of the year. We will find out tomorrow. Um, and just to point out, um, I think with, with the New Year's Eve uh, awards, it does take place all day as well. I do know that Carol has announced um, she's going to give you the results of four on the morning show uh, tomorrow. So I think, was it 12 in total? Or? Yeah, I think there's, there's So four for day. each show then. So it's not just in the evening, it is throughout the day. Uh, so it's split between every show because obviously uh, we, have, we have audiences that follow the same show. So some of you can only watch in the morning, some of you can only watch of an evening or on the mid-show or whatever. Uh, so we split it so that all of you get the chance to see uh, some of the awards uh, that are coming your way. So from 8 a.m. in the morning, if you can tune in, uh, we will announce, oh, I'm, I'll tell you what, tomorrow I'm having a jar my day. <laughs> I'm not going to have a wash. <laughs> I'm not even going to leave. I'm not having any visitors. I'm not, I'm not even going to answer the door. <laughs> I won't answer the door. I'm going to sit under my duvet all day, watch Jury Maker, New Year's Eve. Actually, I've got to get ready to go out, haven't I? I'm going out. Yeah. Yeah. Gin. Oh, the mum's party. Oh, uh, so I had, because I had three consecutive... Um, Christmas parties, and I did say that the mum's party would be the wildest. Yeah. Cancelled. Oh. Yeah. All the mums cried off with germs. <laughs> that time of year, isn't it? It's like one's got a call, the other's like, oh, do you know what? I'm not feeling great. Either. Should we just rearrange this? Yes, please. Yeah. So actually, it was uh, it was very calm. <laughs> it was not wild at all. Um, so yeah, gemstone. Uh, sorry, jewelry maker um, awards tomorrow. This gemstone, I did vote for as gemstone of the year. So did I. Did you? Yeah. I just, I, how, how could I not? How, I love, love, love this gemstone. The quality that we have had is off the scale and it is the best I have ever seen in all of my time in the gemstone industry anywhere i've seen a lot obviously you know i've not seen the world supply of opal but i've seen a lot of opal and this is the look at that one in the middle there yeah. that you know that's no camera trickery that is the play of color that is coming from this gemstone it is just exceptional the reds the oranges the greens the turquoise hues that we're seeing in these as well it's a gemstone that works beautifully with light as well, beautifully with movement, 
as earrings these would look absolutely fantastic wouldn't they just with that movement i always like to think of a a tassel star necklace like literally using yeah. every single one of those yeah. gemstones <laughs> in a tassel star necklace all for me um to look at it is for for i i've said this before and it might sound a little crazy to some of you but i know that some of you totally are in hannah's head with me um i i can't meditate i've tried to do it many many times because my life is very chaotic so sometimes i'm just like right i just need to take a breather and just calm down for a couple of minutes <laughs> and gather my thoughts um and i have a friend that uh, teaches meditation as well and she's tried to to to, to tell me yeah. how and how to switch off i cannot do it like i can't i cannot even do it for 10 seconds it's so hard to think of nothing yeah, it is really like hard. i don't have that skill wonders. at all like, yeah. I, I think it's impossible. It's obviously not, but it is for me. Um, but Opal, for me, I found more and more that with this gemstone, I can be looking at it for so long that after, let's say, I don't know, a minute's time, I've realised that I've not actually thought about anything. Yeah. So for me, it's a form of meditation because it kind of... It kind of transports me somewhere. I don't know where that is, but it just takes me off yeah, for a minute or two. The yeah, yeah, it's just so, so incredible. It really is. Now, in this particular strand, you have 22 carats in your plain pairs, three by two to eight by six millimeters in size. And I think plain is possibly the worst word to yeah. describe this strand you know we're referring to the fact that they are not faceted uh, with that description but oh, I, do, I wish we'd have called them something else they are just phenomenal let me just move that strand out of the way there i do you know i can't believe so we've we've seen this more um a lot lately with the, the parcel that we've had the turquoise hues you know we say blues and ultraviolets but it's the turquoise, the turquoise hues yeah. that we're, we're seeing in this new parcel as well they are phenomenal they really are and it's every single gemstone on that strand that you have that is full of color that is doing exactly what it should be doing it really is i'll just hold that out as well for you i always kind of twist them together so we get maximum impact with the color but if i just hold it out you can see how long that strand is and how many gemstones that you have do you know even if you only had one of these gemstones it would it would give so much impact it really would because of that display of color that you see look at that red that one is on fire they're stunning. So you've got 22 carats in this strand. You then have 60 carats in your nugget strand as well. These are beautiful, these nugget strands. They really, really are. And what I like about the nugget strands is we're seeing lots of different tones in the base colour as well. Uh, so whereas with that strand, uh, the majority being uh, very transparent, uh, kind of clear to white in their base colour. These are kind of white amber hues, caramels in there you've got as well really pretty and you're still getting all of that play of color even with your nugget i love nuggets i absolutely yeah. love them I really do uh so you've got 60 carats of your ethiopian opal nuggets two by one to six by two millimeters and that is an 85 centimeter strand that you have there it would be very wrong to put this with anything else but 925 sterling silver you do have a 20 piece findings pack here uh you've got two of your bolt ring clasps You've got four of your crimp covers, four of your crimp tubes. You've got four um, of your jump rings. I'll just check the size of those for you. Jump rings are three and a half millimetres in your inner diameter. So they'll be five and a half on your outer diameter. You've got a pair of shepherd's hooks and you've got four of your standard ball head pins in there as well. So 20 pieces in total. Have a look at the jewellery. I want them all. <laughs> Look, look at that. Yeah, I just have to do just that one single because it's just so pretty just on its own. Isn't that amazing? So I didn't so even beautiful. want to wrap the top of it because I just wanted to see all of all of that pearl yeah, shape. Yeah. yeah. It's just incredible. It's beautiful. And I love that sterling silver chain that you've added in there as well. Lots of you do already have sterling silver chain in your stash. Um, keep your eyes peeled for sterling silver. The flex right as well. These would look amazing. Oh my gosh, look at that. So I use the different colours with the, within the nuggets to yeah. sort of put them sort of more goldeny tones towards the centre just to give that a bit more of an effect. That's yeah. gorgeous. I love that. Really, really pretty. So 
I mean, all of these components individually on the web, £80 and 85 pence. However, oh, that's that one. Look, I'm not even moving that. Yeah. Not even moving it. And look at the colour that's coming from those opals. They are phenomenal. £80 and 85 pence. Not your price tag today. Now, we are really limited. In fact, this is probably one of the most limited edition kits I've ever brought to you. I think we've got 33, something like that. 31, 33. £49 and 95 pence. That is a big chunk of money. This strand by itself, I think, Absolutely. <laughs> would be... Oh, in fact, it launched at 59.95. Oh, there we go. 49.95, absolutely incredible. 0800 644 limited edition kit. I always get a bit um, a bit upset when we're so low in quantity, but actually I think for the buyer that's really quite nice to have yeah, something that buy, yeah. is limited edition and yeah. that not everyone has got. Uh, Claire in West Lothian, Christine in the channel ours, Anthony, you're there, uh, Zena in Ronda, Collector in, I'm just going to move my call screen over, uh, Lincolnshire, Mazza in Greater Manchester, you're there as well, Collector in the West Midlands is there, Anne's in, congratulations Faye, you've just tuned in as well, Natalie's on the web, make sure you're checking out as soon as you can for this one limited edition nearly half of the stock has already gone there's loads in baskets because of the quantity on this one i don't want to rush you but do check out if you love your opals then just get this one home see these strands in real life because we have to say it every time they look good on screen but it's nothing compared to what you see in real life because unfortunately studio lights do wash out play of color um, in opals £49.95. Wendy's there. Uh, Hilda's just put hers in a basket. Uh, Anthony's there in Swansea as well. Susan, you're there in Bedfordshire. Congratulations. Collect in Essex. You've just checked out as well. These are going pretty, pretty quickly. Lots of you on the telephone lines as well. Just make sure you're confirming. If you're thinking about it still, but now perhaps thinking, oh, I'm not going to have time now, do it. Do it. Do, do it. it. Definitely do it. Do it. Um, do you know what? If you don't, you'll always wonder. £49.95. CKXC04. I want that one. They have such an impact that you literally only need to use one or, or like the most yeah. I used in a piece is five of that, that main strand. You know, so it's going to go so, so far. Oh my gosh, they are beautiful. How much would you sell that necklace for, Katie? Oh, um, it's all sterling silver, so probably about 80, 90. That is exactly the figure yeah. that I had. I was thinking 80 pounds in my head. I was thinking you couldn't let that go for any less than 80 pounds, yeah. could you? Um, and do you know what? Again, it, it's, it, it's, it's entirely up to you where you price your pieces. But do your research. Uh, just a couple of weeks ago, I was in uh, stratford upon avon and there was a, a jeweller's that had a strand in the window and they were plain rondelles. They were very white in their base colour. There was no spacing, no knotting, nothing. They were just simply stranded. Um, and there was very little play of colour. It could have been the lighting that it was under that didn't help. Um, the price tag on those opals were £995. And I couldn't believe it. Because I was looking at that strand just thinking, oh my gosh, I could buy that from work for less than £50. I know I could get that strand for less than £50 at Joymaker. And it was £995. But if you do look around, again, Ethiopian Opal, it's not massively available. Like, I don't think I've ever seen it on the high street. I, no, I really don't think I have. It's not one of those gemstones, is it? I have seen it, but not. I don't know if it's been on the high street. But just check out the quality and check out the prices because that is an amazing, amazing price tag. It really is. Um, okay, then, Katie, so I'm guessing right. you're going to show so, us Yeah, we're Yeah, we're going to do, do that one with the yeah. five um, because... It's such a beautiful gemstone. I didn't want to put loads and loads together yeah. because I don't think it needs it. Yeah. So, so I'm just going to show you how to make that little bar and then how to wrap them on so that they actually stay without moving. Okay, lovely. Yeah. So I've got one of the head pins. I've got one of the head pins from the kit. And just to start with, I'm going to chop off that little ball on the end there. So, But don't lose that. Keep that because you can pop that in your resin or your polymer clay or something like that. Okay. So I've got that, that little bar there and it's just basically a piece of wire now so I'm going to use uh, some bail making pliers but you could use anything that's got, mm -hmm. got a slight round just to pop that little bit of a curve into it so just using the warmth from your your fingers or your thumb just to pop a little bit of a 
bend into it. And that's all we want is that curve. Yeah. Okay. So now I'm going to pop a loop onto each end, but I want the loop to actually come downwards because if you think about it, our chain's going to come off from this angle here. Yeah. So we want the actual loop, the bottom, the opening of the loop to be at the bottom so mm -hmm. that we don't lose our, you know, lose it off our chain or anything if we were to catch it. Okay. So just pop in your pliers in right at the very, very tip there and then just working it round, just reposition your, your, hand, <coughs> your hand, your pliers and pop a little loop in at one side and then turning it round and just making sure you keep it nice and level and then pop a little loop down on this side as well. So just working that round and you want that to come as close as possible and then just popping my pliers in and making sure that we're level at each side so so this one's horizontal and this one's horizontal okay mm -hmm. so now we've got that little bend and our little connections at each side i've just got some i've got 0 0.2 wire but um a four mil will fit okay. uh, not sorry 0 0.4 will will yeah. go through the gemstones no problem as well okay and i'm going to start wrapping i've probably got about 30 centimeters mm -hmm. and i'm going to start wrapping in the center so I'm just going to pop a few wraps on, it's a little bit fiddly there, and pop about two or three wraps on just to get our wire attached. Okay, so I'm going to take my largest stone, so I've got five arranged out, and so I'll just take a little bit of time just to find your right sizes so that, okay. so that it's going to flow nicely. Okay, so I've got my wire attached there, I'm going to pop my first gemstone on. That will come straight through there. And what I want to do is I want to wrap that, but I want the tip of the gemstone just to sit on top. So mm -hmm. I know that all this side's going to be the facing side, yeah. yet, the, the forked side. So around, so the gemstone's just popping over the front of the wire and then a couple of wraps just on that side. And the wire's coming from underneath again. And then I'm going to add my next one. Now they're going to sit a little bit sort of higgledy piggledy at first but that's why we're going to set them mm -hmm. afterwards once we've attached all these so our first one's attached then we're going to pop the next one on and then pop around and just wrapping each one on but just making sure it's sitting so that the actual tip of the gemstone is on the front of the bar mm -hmm. so you're going to continue doing that don't worry if your bar kind of slips around because you can just turn it around okay. okay so you're going to add each one like so adding the next one and then again across the other side using this part of the wire so then you will end up with them all attached like so and then a wire at each side okay so that's that's great they're all attached but they're quite sort of loose mm -hmm. on the bar so we're just going to move this one out of the way for a second and what I'm going to do is I'm going to come underneath the back so I'm going underneath that first gemstone and then I'm going to wrap twice around it so that's kind of going to set it on the front, making sure that my wires don't overlap. Then I'm going to come up in between and then around just to help that set in the middle there. So a couple of wraps in between. Then again, we're going to come around the back, around the back and then wrapping over. So we're just wrapping the top of these little tips of the gemstones. So, and around again, and we're going to continue doing this until we get to the other end. So it's a little bit fiddly at first. So one, two wraps in between, then across and underneath at the back, and then two wraps over the front of the gemstone. So we've got two wraps against each of these, and then around and just get to the other end a couple of times underneath and then over the top so it's starting to feel a little bit more sort of set in now and then around and then finishing off that last one and then what you're going to do is once you've got to this end and to finish that this wire off and then you're going to do the exact same and go back again so that's going to set them off set them even firmer kind of in there. So all we're doing is kind of stabilising them against that bar. So that one's <laughs> taken off there. So at the moment, we've got little double wraps against uh, on top of each of those there. Mm -hmm. You see that there? Yeah. yeah. 
And then we're going to do the exact same again, so with the opposite side of wire. So I'm just going to add a wrap just on the end there, then come across underneath the back and then a couple of wraps in the opposite direction. Mm -hmm. So we're just adding wraps and just adding more stability mm -hmm. to each of these. So and it's just a matter of working our way back across. Wow. So across the front and then in between, across the back and then around and in between across the back and then so you're doing all these little wraps so mm -hmm. they're all sitting nice and neat on the front across and two wraps on that last one and then all you need is just finish that off with a couple of wraps and trim off okay and then that's your so little connect connector just there so they are oh, that looks so pretty doesn't it that's a perfect way of setting them as well. It's almost yeah. They it's almost they don't kind of look like they've kind of got a little bit of a brille wrap yeah, on top yeah. of them, but they're against the bar and they're not because before they were kind of quite, quite mm. loose, but now they're, they're really nice and solid. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's lovely. That's a really really pretty component, isn't it? You can have that in a bracelet as well. Yeah, of course you can. Little lovely in a bracelet. Oh, thank you for showing us that, Katie. Gorgeous. Um, if you still have that in your basket, check out. Loads of you have, so a massive, massive congratulations. Uh, but there are still approximately 10 in baskets right now. It's a limited edition kit. There's only 30, well, there were only 33, it's not anymore. Uh, 33 chances is all we had. That is, for me personally, the most limited edition uh, kit that I have, have ever had. Have, 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 yeah, have. yeah, I think it's my most limited. That, yeah. that strand's amazing, though. Oh, isn't it I could cool. not believe it when I opened the parcel. Oh, no. I think I need that to go with my ring. Yeah. Hayley Kruger. Um, right. Coming up for you at... Oh, we're doing it now. Oh, you're perfect timing. Hmm. Let's do it now. Do you know what I love about these? They almost look, they remind me of the wooden beads that we used yeah. to have, you know? We used to have lots of um, the tiger ebony woods and things like that. It also reminds me of um, caramel nibbles. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm. Chocolate and caramel swirls. Look at these. They are so chocolatey in their colour. They are. <laughs> they are really, really beautiful. Again, it's one of those gemstones, isn't it, that looks very natural. You know, I always say like Jasper's very natural looking, very organic, um, because it has those kind of really earthy tones to it. You've definitely, definitely got that with your bronzite, haven't you? Uh, a member of the Proxene group of minerals you've got here, this is completely natural. You've got 510 carrots in total in your bronzite rounds there 12 millimeters in size i think 12 millimeters is a fab fab size if you are somebody that does like that statement piece of jewelry then i think 12 mils just knotted or yeah. stranded or whatever is a really really great size to have but actually it's perfect on its own as well so if you yeah, just have one I tend in to a pendant 12 or... the 12 anything 12 and above in a like a spinner pendant yeah so oh, nice. work design and something like this because you've got all that lovely texture yeah the, it is it's stuff. almost yeah. like i want to say like the grain in wood yeah, on that, some of them amazing, and though. That's, it's like a planet isn't it that's beautiful. It just kind of remind me of rock formations and things like that. Quite beachy and rocky with its feel as well. IRGP48 is your code. These are the largest. I have a feeling the largest size, the biggest, biggest carrot weight. Um, and we're starting at 995 pretty impressive isn't it 0800 644 655 you've got 2 4 6 8 10 12 14 16 18 20 22 24 26 28 30 32 33 gents pieces Brilliant. these are perfect Brilliant aren't they gents, but just one yeah just one on a piece of leather maybe something like that oh that would look nice on some leather cord really really beautiful and again you know there's not that many i don't we shouldn't really um but you know there's not many gemstone strands that we would say lend themselves you know to gents designs yeah. you know for example that faceted rondelle strand of almatrine 
the first thing that would jump into my head wouldn't be a gents design with that one but it is with this got a really masculine feel to it and i think you know if you've got any of the tiger ebony woods or any of the little wooden beads uh, some of them we had like um some really bright red ones as well yeah. or maybe some bright red eslan and stuff like that or maybe going down like the the tibetan style jewelry yes. and things like that yeah. with these would look fab jade i would look nice with jade eyes. yeah IR GP48 is your code for those. Massive well done if you've managed to check out loads and loads if you come in through for this one. So well done to you. Remember, you've got a 30 day money back guarantee. It doesn't start from today, it starts from the day you get these delivered to your door. Oh, which is in a couple of days' time, which actually will then be January. It's so then, next year. Next year. You've got till next year to think about it. No, actually, you won't get them till next year, will you now? Which is only a couple of days, don't panic. Uh, £9.95 IRGP48. Absolutely tons and tons of these in baskets. Check out as soon as you can. Don't hang around. Please don't think that you um, have got to wait and maybe you want to you know, continue shopping, see what else is coming up in this hour. Um, and you're thinking, well, I'll just wait and I'll just add to my order and then I'll, I'll check out then. It doesn't matter how many times you log in and check out. It doesn't matter how many times you dial in on the phone lines and it doesn't matter how many times you tap the app. In fact, you can do all three. You keep combining to that one order. Um, unless you ask otherwise, your order stays open until midnight uh, on any one day. Um, so you've got until midnight tonight. You can keep combining that order. Midnight, that order is closed, and then we get that order ready to be shipped. You only have one amount charged to your card or for shipping there as well. So please don't panic, just check it out. 9.95. Uh, 10 mils for you. So slightly smaller inside. Again, it is personal preference, and I think a lot of the time it depends on what you are wanting to do with the gemstone. It might be, um, I'm thinking of a design that we have um, on, on the uh, stairs on the way, the big yeah, turquoise the, yeah, and the reds in there. That, yeah, I think it is actually works, like wooden so. beads in yeah. that one. It's very kind of tribally, isn't it? Yeah. Um, but it's just made me think of that design all of a sudden I've just seen it then and thinking oh yes like if you've got any turquoise you know um, or magnesite turquoise coloured magnesite and reds and you wanted to go for something a bit tribal yeah, or you know something with your copper wires yeah, like yeah. It's, it really is a very organic looking gemstone. Uh, 360 carats of your bronze like you have in this strand you've got 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38 gemstones that could be 19 pairs of earrings 38 pendants if you want it to be how many pennies each? 21 pennies each that's all charms. Well, if you want to make like key rings for the guys and yeah. stuff like that, you know, perfect for that as well. Seven pounds and ninety-five pence for you this evening. Make sure you're checking out. Get dialing, pressing in one button. One postage to pay in any one day of just three pounds and ninety-five pence. So if you have already purchased from us today, you've got nothing to lose. Have for you free telephone number, thirty-day money-back guarantee. S U G P zero six. Um, so the eight mil size. Uh, go to stretchy has to be for me the yeah. 8mm it's like I always call it your throw on piece of jewellery and by yeah. that I mean um, if you are somebody that really it's like not necessarily somebody that likes to wear lots of jewellery but you know there are certain pieces if you don't have certain pieces on you may not make it it's one of those that's what, like a throw on piece of jewellery yeah. like you know if I'm popping out to do the school run you know, it might be something that I like yeah, to I've quickly pop on. Yeah, and it yeah. feels weird. Yeah. You know, it does, it does, it's one of those, I think, that you will wear every single day of the week on the school run, going to the supermarket, or wear it on the beach. Let's talk about the beach. Yeah, that would be my beach piece of joy. Not in this weather, in this country, Leah, no. <laughs> I'm somewhere else, hot and sunny right now. Um... But saying that, it's very mild. Very mild. Really? Yeah. Yesterday, I keep looking at the long range and it's just not. not I, no, cold. I know. Yeah, it's not, is it? Yesterday, when I drove in, it was 13 degrees. And I was actually thinking, do you know what? Just a couple of degrees more yeah. and it would be t shirt, no coat weather. Like, yeah. That's like, that's crazy for this time of year. But do you know what? I think for us, it's kind of like, it's like a, a dead cert, isn't it? If it's Christmas. 
it's not going to be cold. It's not going. It's not going to look Christmassy, is it? No. no, of course it's not. We're not going to have a white Christmas. We're not even going to have a frost. It's going to be warm and grey. <laughs> Two hundred. <laughs> I love Christmas, I do. Uh, £5.95. I just want a white Christmas. That's what I would like. We had the last, the last official white Christmas was 2010. It wasn't in the Midlands. <laughs> However, um, for it to be classified as a white Christmas, only one snowflake has to fall on the roof of the Met Office. How ridiculous is that? Yes. Oh, it can be anyway, actually, yeah. Telephone, it can be. I do remember yeah. a slight flurry that's, in 2006. That's what the, that's what the Met Office say. One, yeah. one. But who, who is the person that sits there waiting for waiting that one snowflake? Yeah. I think I just saw is one. Is there something Did we I need to one? call if we see one? Yeah, I don't, yeah. I don't know how it works. Like, you know, can I say it was a white Christmas because I saw a snowflake in my back garden? No, I didn't. No, no. no. Lee got a bit excited. <laughs> Did you? <laughs> Can I say it was a white Christmas? No, I didn't. I didn't. Uh, well done if you managed to get that one. Right, six millimetres, desert island size. Oh. Lovely size, six mil. Stack of bracelets, desert island size. We've waited so long for Bronze Light to come back like this, to have all the different sizes. Do you well. know, I can't even tell you the last time I had any strand of Bronze Light, never mind Ages. four strands back to back. Really, really beautiful. 100. And is that a three or a five? <laughs> three. 130 carats of your bronze eye in your six millimeter rounds. 38 centimeters in length with this one. Again, six mil round. Any medium you can incorporate it into your seed beading, into your macrame, your kumihimo, um, your wire work, in with your clays, anything with a six mil round. I love the fact that we can use this for the ladies' pieces and the gents' pieces as well. So, the versatility that we have in this particular strand as well, there's no end. YB GP26, <coughs> excuse me, 800. Six double four, six double five. No, Leah, I am not. I was. Sur we're surrounded by people that have the lurgy, mm. Katie. I. I was saying. I was showing off a bit earlier on in the office. That I don't get ill. <laughs> I don't really get ill. I do drink my Barocca every day. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have time to be ill. No. <laughs> Uh, four pounds and ninety-five pence. YB GP <laughs> twenty-six is your code. Apparently, direct Adam sneezed in my handbag just to test the theory. <laughs> oh, eight hundred six double four six double five. Tell you, Adam. I tell you, if I have to have a day off, you'll be around babysitting. That's what you'll be doing. Tumbleweed, absolute tumbleweed. <laughs> <laughs> no, not babysitting me, looking after my children because I can't because I'm poorly. <laughs> Honestly, it's only quarter to eight. Four pounds and 95 pence. A massive, massive well done if you managed to get that one. Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, what should it be? Uh, like they're frosted ones. Yeah. Look at these. Oh, oh these are pretty. Oh, look at that one there. Oh, I love oh, that one. That one's amazing. Look at the banding on that. Oh, like the one underneath. It's like a oh, moon. Oh yeah, and then you've got like that bit of druzy in there as well. That is like the moon in yeah. the sky. Look at that twinkly oh, stars that. and then the moon. One. Yeah. Can't oh, guarantee whoa. this in your strand. Just want to point that out. They will all be <laughs> slightly different, but look, I mean, that's again that that for me that one there. That's like um, the pictures of the Maldives from the yeah. sky. Look at the greens and the blues in that one. That one there. Oh, wow. They're quite. They're quite. Um, it's reminded me of kind of like um, like planets and Planet, space, yeah. but then it's making me think of the sea as well. That one. It was a bit like a whale, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. 
really really beautiful these um your agate frosted rounds you've got here i do love the frosted ones again you know it's nice to have that high polish on some gemstones but again sometimes if you want something that is perhaps a little bit more masculine or better suited to the guys this might be a better option you know um and it does give you a different texture there's almost there is a heart in that one look at that one can't guarantee that in your strand a little druzy heart. Yeah. Adam says, is it a heart? <laughs> well, I don't have any contacts in, but it is, isn't it, Katie? Yeah. Yeah, that's a heart there. Five pounds and ninety-five pence. You have two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty-two, twenty-four, twenty-six, twenty-eight, thirty, thirty-two, thirty-four, thirty-six, thirty-eight individual gemstones on that strand there. HSGP ninety-seven is your code for that one. Right, the point full version for you. Oh, Boom. look at that. <gasps> Show you this one. This is where I picked the strand up. Oh, I've just seen another one there as well. Look at that. Oh, look. That's so magical. Really, really pretty. And then there's another one here. Look at that. Wow. Oh, I love these. See, that for me might be a pair of earrings. It's not a matching yeah. pair, but yeah. just, you know, that little bit of sparkle in each one there. Absolutely gorgeous. Uh, so this is the purple version, same size. Uh, where were we? Eight millimetres in size, these ones. 0800, 655. They look really great together, actually, as well, mixing those colours. I like that one there. Oh, that's isn't that, so I love strands like this where you can just get them home and have a look and you've essentially got, you know, however many one of a kind, haven't you? Because yeah. they're all individual and unique. You may get some that are very, very close to a match, um, but the markings, you know, will differ, generally speaking, on all of those gemstones there. 0800, 6244, 6245, 6 pounds and 95 pence for you this evening. All you've got to do is dial that number, hit your number one button and confirm with the call centre. Right. Um, which, uh, what should it be, sorry, Beck? Yeah, I think they're a little bit out of order. There we go. Not sorry. Uh, jump ring bundle for you. Essentials. If you're brand new to us here at Jewelry Maker, you will need these uh, to make bracelets and to make your necklace designs as well. They are essentially connectors. So what we would do is use them at the end of bracelets or the end of your necklaces to attach your clasp to. Um, I was only saying yesterday, actually, before I worked here at Jewelry Maker, I never looked at the workings of a piece of jewellery. You know, all I was interested in is the actual gemstone or the precious metal. Um, but it is interesting that once you do start making jewellery, yeah, or obviously you work about the you, mechanics yeah, behind it, yeah. You know, you, you look at things properly and you might pick up a necklace on the high street and look at a, um, a clasp and a jump ring and think, oh, that's not closed properly, yeah. is it? It's not closed properly. Um, our jump rings are phenomenal. They really are very very, very well made uh, here at Jawmaker. Um, Fleur Hastings, guest designer Fleur Hastings, who is the queen of chain mail, who gets through three and a half thousand jump rings a week. In fact, probably more now. Um, will tell you how great these are in terms of how well they are cut. We can make our own, but it is very, very time consuming. Very time consuming. Much easier to come in and buy yourself a bundle of seven, five, and four millimeter jump rings. Now, you will get 200 of each, so that's actually 600 jump rings. So, you've got all of these different sizes, which is brilliant because you know it's all about getting your balance right and, and, and making sure that your piece looks um, more balanced, I guess. You know, if you had the 12 mil rounds, for example, we probably wouldn't go for the smallest of the jump rings out of this bundle, we might go for one of the other two. But if you've got all three there, you can just pop one on and see how yeah. it looks, see how it balances it's got, out. It's got to balance with your gemstone and your clasp, yeah, yeah, exactly. So, it's always great to have them in stash, but of course, if you are a chain mailer 200 of each size is fantastic and you'll know of course if you are chain mailing that you do get through a lot of your jump rings tfxc59 is your code nine pounds and 95 pence for 600 of your jump rings you've got here that's amazing absolutely incredible i hundred six double four six double five and we can use them in so many different ways where you can use them as spacers so if you just wanted to stretch your bracelet with the eight mil rounds 
Uh, it might be that you take your 7mm gem rings and just pop them as spacers in between mm. each of your gemstones on your stretchy. You've then got an anchor point to attach to if you want to add a charm there. It's adding a little bit of luster into your design as well. It might be um, that you are just literally making a Mobius ring and yeah. hanging that on a shepherd's hook. Yeah. So you've made a design feature well, with your gem rings. you've got a bracelet and you want to add a bit of an extended chain but you haven't got yeah. any. And you just use the smaller ones just to add that little bit yeah, of an yeah. extension. Yeah. Perfect for that. And, and pinch bales as well, you know, you can turn them into pinch bales yeah. if you've got uh, gemstones whereby, uh, you know, you, you can't attach a normal bale to, if you like, or whatever you've got in your stash, then use these as pinch bales as well. £9.95, TFXC59 is your code, 0800 655. Loads of these in baskets right now. Just make sure you're checking out. Well done. Have we had any text there? Okay. Oh, is it broke? No. No. It's not broke. 60777, strike message with the word James to anything you like. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get into it. We love text messages. We love to have a chat here at Jamaica. I love a chat, especially this time of night. It's New Year's Eve tomorrow. Do people have tomorrow off? It's New Year's day it's not it's not bank holiday it's is new year's it? day a bank holiday i, I believe so so yeah. do we have to go into absolute panic tomorrow that the shops are going to be shut for a day like we did christmas my local shop was open all day christmas day oh is it yeah gosh not new year's day I th no i think it's like christmas day new year's day yeah i think everywhere's shut yeah yeah, I, I really <laughs> Does anybody know? I'm sure, I'm sure that the supermarkets are shut on New Year's Day. Like, it's, I'm sure it's like Christmas Day. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, uh, wow. oh, look at those. Oh, I haven't <gasps> seen these. Can I just say, you've got to get these. Um, because... We've had pink opal, we've had the blue opal, green opal, the initial parcel of green opal that we had was literally nothing. It was absolutely tiny and you have two, look at the colour of those, two huge green opals um, in with this pack here. 96 carats of your multicolored opals, 16 by 12 to 24 by 18 millimeters in size. You are guaranteed to get a pack of six. I want to say that you're guaranteed to get two of each color. It doesn't say on my graphics, no. but I'm pretty confident in saying that you will. Um, two in the pink, two in the blue, and two in the green as well they are so pretty look at those <gasps> just do you know what with oh, it's oh, it's such a tranquil tranquil hue really soft again really really calm and look at the, I love the sizes of these rings pendants with yeah, these I'm as well thinking maybe a seed bead embroidery piece and using them all <gasps> really amazing get some beautiful seed beads colors to match just, in with we that. don't see yeah. the greens they are gorgeous really really pretty oh cute are you one three is your code for these oh eight hundred six double four six double five or on the web it's peruvian as well it is peruvian i cannot tell you how limited that parcel of in fact i'm pretty confident in saying that when we had when we initially got the parcel of peruvian opal we had so little of the green peruvian opal we couldn't even make strands with what we had we didn't have enough for that it's so so rare 29 pounds and 95 imagine that in a ring oh. Oh, i just love which one of those do you prefer out of interest kate because this one's got quite a lot of markings I in whereas this one hasn't do you i prefer yeah. this one you see but isn't it, it's I we've all got our own personal well. preferences see that one's like a cloudy sky isn't yeah. it like white fluffy swirls of clouds in that one Really pretty. £29 and 95 pence for you. 800 655. Again, you're looking at something that is incredibly rare. With this opal, it's not about play of colour, it's about the base colour. Do you know what? Those greens, to me, look like they're neon. They're like, like they're luminous, yeah, they almost, don't they? 
Um, when it comes to pricing with these, bearing in mind the green is far rarer, I would be putting a higher price tag on the greens oh, there. Absolutely. For sure. Absolutely. In fact, I don't think I'd part with them, but if I was to. Uh, I ended six double four, six double five. Collectors with these in their baskets, well done to you. In fact, Moira's has just got two, so a huge, huge well done. That, do you know what? If you love your opals, multi buy, multi buy, multi buy. Um, Debbie in Worcestershire. Absolutely, I can't see it on any screen. Hi, ladies. Loving the show, as always. Hannah, your ring is beautiful. <laughs> what does that say? Oh, was, was the from Jen? From Jen? I am, it's not that I can't read. It's, I don't have my contact lenses in. I'm not, I've got three screens to choose from, and I can't see any of them. Um, yes, the opal. I'll tell you a very quick story. Um, so... <laughs> The um, the opal is a 75 point Ethiopian opal solitaire and we had them on the show probably going back, I don't know, four months or so ago. And I think we launched them at like 49.95, which was amazing anyway, but they did end up going down to 29.95 and they sold out so quickly. So literally everyone here at Jewelry Maker was like, oh my gosh, I have to have one. And with it being gemstone quality and a solitaire as well, we were like, right, that's it. Um, so I managed to get a couple and um, I knew I had to keep one of them for myself and Hayley Kruger does a lot of soldering um, and metal work as well so I just said to Hayley I want a really simple setting, I want to let all of the light into that gemstone and I'd like a bit of texturing on the band, I'd like it 925 sterling silver gold plated, thank you. And then she returned it to me on the 28th of December. And I'm so excited. It's amazing. I love it. And you know, my cousin as well, one of my cousins who has been down from Wales um, for Christmas, she doesn't wear jewellery. She's not a jewellery person at all. And straight away, she's like, oh, I love that ring. I love that ring. I had lots of compliments on it. Thank you. Um, right, coming up for you after the break, today's must-have for you. Loads more treats. Got two more hours with you here on the Late Show. Got another kit coming your way and another demonstration as well. So don't go anywhere. We'll be back with you in a few. Watch us on Freeview. We have some very exciting news to share with you. From Monday the 7th of January 2019, Jewelry Maker will be on Freeview HD 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Please be aware that if you have an HD Freeview TV, you'll need to retune from 1pm on the 7th to take advantage of this, to ensure you don't miss out on any jewelry making goodies. If you're in an area that doesn't have HD coverage, but you have a connected TV, don't panic. You can still watch JM by going to channel 73, where you'll find our sister channel, Sewing Quarter. Simply click on the red button, and this will give you the option to watch JM all day. Don't forget you can also view Jewelry Maker on Sky, Virgin, Freesat, and the fastest way to shop with us is online at jewelrymaker.com. Or download the Jewelry Maker app. Tune in from Monday the 7th of January for 24 hours of Jewelry Maker on Freeview HD. Jewelry Maker have an extensive range of DVDs for all abilities. Each of our mediums has an introductory DVD to help you get started. If you're already an experienced jewelry maker, we have a collection of projects and more advanced DVDs to take your designs to the next level. We are always filming new DVDs with our specialist guest designers, so visit our website for more information. At Jewelry Maker, we are always looking at ways to provide you with a fantastic shopping experience. With this in mind, we'd like to welcome you to our new pre-order option. Selected items throughout the day will be put on display and made available for pre-order. When the presenter informs you that the pre-order service is available on an item, this is your chance to pop it into your online basket or speak to one of our brilliant call centre team members and be one of the first to secure your purchase. Did you know that if you go to jewelrymaker.com and sign up to our mailing list, then you'll receive 10% off your first order with us. We'll also keep you updated with special offers, themed shows, program guides and Jewelry Maker tutorials. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Are you new to Jewelry Maker? For a limited time, we're offering new customers a wonderful free gift 
The free gift includes two beautiful genuine gemstone strands in an organza bag. As long as you qualify as a new customer and haven't shopped with us before, then your free gift will be automatically added to your order when you make your first purchase. It's really that simple. Gemstone strands are selected at random, so gemstone size, colour and type will vary for each new customer. Why stop there? Once you receive your gemstones, we'd love to see what you create. Share your designs with us via our Facebook page and join our creative community of jewellery makers. Start your jewellery making journey with us today. Create. Wear. Share. Love Jewellery Maker but don't have an account? You can now purchase items on the Jewellery Maker website through our guest checkout. To do so, select the products you wish to purchase and head over to the shopping basket. Simply enter your email address and select continue as guest below. After this, the checkout process is simple. Select your quantity and delivery option and then check out securely. Enter your billing details in either a credit card or PayPal account and proceed to payment. From here, you still have the option to create an account if you wish, making shopping online easier for you. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. The Jewelry Maker Wall of Fame is where you get to showcase your skills as a jewelry designer. Each week, one lucky entrant will win £100 credited to their account, and the runner-up receives £50. If you want to enter your design, just send a photo to studio at jewelrymaker.com, or you can post your photos to Jewelry Maker Studio, Ivy House, Henley Road, Studley, B80, 7DU, and make sure you don't forget your customer number. Get making and good luck. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Did you know that when you book a Jewelry Maker workshop, you're given exclusive access to our Jewelry Maker shop? You can browse through special items and offers, be privy to selected discounts and deals that you can't get at any other time. Shop whilst you learn and grab yourself some amazing offers. For more information on workshops and available dates, contact our call centre. I can see, I can see, I can see. <laughs> That's what you look like. You look lovely today. <laughs> um, welcome back to Joy Maker. And if you've just tuned in, you are just in time for today's must have, uh, which we had quite a few texts about earlier on because um, you can see them from space. Not literally. Um, <laughs> but you can. No, you're saying nuggets. I'm confused because, like, are they these ones? Okay. They're giant faceted gemstones. Exactly, they're like, like not nuggets at all to me. These are amazing. The colour of these is fab as well. This reminds me of angelite. I think it's it's probably the closest thing yeah. to angelite in colour um, that we've ever had actually out of any other gemstone. It's really, really quite different. And actually, seeing it on camera now, it's, it's quite marbly in its it appearance, is. isn't it? Really pretty. They are chunky monkeys. You've got 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 19 individual gemstones. They are 18 millimetres uh, in size. 18, are they 18 millimetres or are they 20 by 15? Sorry, 20 by 15, 760 carats in total you have there. I just think I'd have to use them individually, Casey, I think, because they're so yeah, big. Yeah, definitely. Aren't they? Individual pendants. I mean, that's weighty. Yeah. Like, if you were to, to restrand, which you could, uh, you know, some people like to really know that they're wearing their jewellery. Some of us prefer the lighter weight, perhaps of amber. Um, but if you do want to feel the weight in your jewellery, goodness me. You'd feel that around your neckline. It really is weighty. VXTA52 is your code for these 0800 644 655. Um, I think I heard the words ridiculous and price in my ear not so long ago. I can confirm they are ridiculously priced. VXTA52 0800 644 655. Just 
I'm thinking one of these, um, and you mentioned earlier on, just with you know, just some wire perhaps yeah. caged around the gemstone, yeah. keeping it in place and just adding a bit of luster to it as well. Yeah, just just oh, popping sweet. a little little wire design on it, and then mm. just pressing that against the gemstone, and then you the rest of your wire goes through the centre. Yeah, and there's just a wrap loop on top. Yeah. That would look great. I think that's all I would do with these. I just think, again, um, statement pendants like that are very on trend at the moment. You know, kind of 13-inch drop in your chain, big gemstone on the bottom. You can have tassels of chain from the bottom. You could use the tassels that we get on our uh, strands here at Jewelry Maker if you want to. Adding some wire in there for some luster splash. Of and actually, do you know what? I'm thinking silver, gold, antique bronze, yes. copper. It's all going to work with Euros, this, is gold, it? everything's going to work with that. Yeah, definitely. VXTA 52. £29 and 95 pence is not your price tag. Now, do remember that nobody pays any more than anybody else. Everybody only ever pays that final low closing price tag. So... Just to very briefly explain how that how, how that works is um, because your order stays open till midnight tonight. Basically, everybody that checks out in any auction, uh, the warehouse get the item code and a list of names with customer numbers and the final or closing price tag. And that is the amount that gets charged to everybody's card. They don't go through every single person and look at what point you checked out. Nobody pays any more than anybody else. So you can't possibly check out too soon. The quicker you check out, the better, because then you've secured your purchase. £19.95. Are these brand new? Oh, never been seen before. Very wintry, but quite summery as well. Yeah, it definitely they? worked through all the seasons. Yeah, yeah definitely. definitely. I like 100, 6 double four, 6 double five. I'm thinking maybe with some bee war pearls now. Ooh, quite beachy, yeah. maybe. Yeah, so here we go. Now I've mentioned the beach. Becky's awake. VXTA 52, 600. I beg your pardon, 760 carats in total you've got there. Well done if you've managed to check those out. In fact, if you were mixing them up with the other shapes as well. Yeah. Maybe going for a um, very weighted design. Quite quirky with different shapes. Yeah. Well, Avant-garde sort of yeah. look, you know, really kind of goes really heavy. Piece, but it's on just nice thick mm. chain around the back. Yeah. That's right. It is nice, isn't it, to get these strands home as well, just to experiment and see how yeah. different shapes are going to work, how different gemstones will work together. You know, I've said many times before that I am very much a creature of habit and you know like for opal ethiopian opal i would always say i'll always leave that gemstone by itself i would never put it with anything else um you know i always tend to put labradorite with moonstone always tend to do the same but sometimes when you get certain strands you get them home and you put them next to something accidentally and then yeah. think oh my gosh that really works that really looks fab and then end up putting something together that you wouldn't normally do um, and that's another great thing about getting them home um, and having a look at the gemstone for yourself as well well done if you've managed to check those out at 19 pounds and 95 pence for you well done uh, so the faceted squares, <laughs> I did call them pillows. But they are like the cushions. They are, aren't they? These are oh, rings. Imagine that as a rings. statement ring. Bracelets. Oh, yes. They are like, for me, the perfect, perfect size for a statement piece of jewellery. That looks to me now like blue chalcedony. That's beautiful. Yeah. Really, really pretty. 360 carats of your aqua frosted quartz like you've got here. 18 millimetres in size, 38 centimetres strand. Again, on the wrist, you could actually uh, just make a stretchy with those, couldn't yeah. you? How lush is that? Oh, they fit together really, really well. I keep thinking of um, shell and pearl as well. And I think I'm, I'm, I'm leaning more towards the summer vibe with these. They're a lovely, lovely blue hue. I don't know if I'm right with this, but I want to say azure blue. I don't actually know what that is, but... I think that sounds about right. Does it? Yeah, I've, I've had some wire ones that was azure blue. And okay. It, what's that tone? That's... I just want to say that. I don't know why. FDTA35 is your code. I will have them for you, tell you exactly what you've got on this strand. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 20. Um, I, I just again I just look it's sort of quite vintage and then I'm thinking smoky quartz maybe with these would that work yeah well even the bronze like that we've just had yes definitely well it's quite it's close to it on the uh, on the T bar yeah. anyway so but yeah that see that does work chocolate and blues yeah mm. 
24 pounds and 95 pence summer sky yes adam oh is it so that is azure then azure blue um, is apparently defined as the color of the sky on a clear day i think we might be right. Yeah. Uh, 17 pounds and 95 pence for you this afternoon. 0800 644 655. Again, brand new. You will be the first people uh, to get these into your stash and you could potentially be the last looking at my call screen as well. So a massive well done. Very busy evening here at Jewelry Maker. What day is it today? Oh my gosh. Do you know what? Really, really thought somebody was going to tell me it was like Friday or Saturday. <laughs> it's it's so that dead. limbo time, isn't it, in between Christmas and New Year? Yeah. Nobody knows what day it is. And you don't, do you? I no. think everybody, just I think it's the roast. It feels like a Sunday. Whatever yeah. day Christmas Day is, it feels like a Sunday, doesn't it? Yeah, but it's Sunday today. Sunday today, Monday tomorrow, New Year's Eve. It's exciting. Grown out, aren't you? <laughs> FTTA 35, you watch 10 o'clock. I'm like, can we go home now? I'm really tired. <laughs> 17 pounds and 95 pence. Very exciting day here at Jewelry Maker. Uh, tomorrow we have our Jewelry Maker Awards for every show. Uh, Liz in Kent says, so wintry and yet so summery. These quartz are stunning. Yeah. Yes. That's perfect. Yeah. It it's is, kind of got isn't that it? Frozen esque look, hasn't yeah, it? Yeah, you kind but... of. And it is actually looking at them on the recording there. It is like the layers yeah. of ice with the that frostiness you get, isn't it? of the, yeah. the yeah. Definitely, but then yes, Liz, so summery, so summery. I hope we see lots of sky that colour this year. Yeah. I want the summer like last year, yeah. this year even. This year, yeah. Yeah, it was. We had a summer. We had a, a season, one, yeah. like a season yeah. of summer, not just the odd day. It was constant. Bit much for some. I loved it. Lived every minute of it. I did. I loved it. Um, have a look at these. They are huge. We've seen yesterday. I think I had. Was it twenty millimeters? <laughs> twenty millimeters. Oh my gosh! What gemstone did I have? Ah, oh, uh, was it obsidian? Oh my gosh! I can't remember. Um, the last couple of uh, weeks, I've had really, really massive gemstones in rounds. We're getting some of the largest rounds I think we've ever seen. These ones, eighteen millimeters in size. They are gorgeous. These are like a summer sky because you can almost see those wisps of clouds. Yeah. In them. Oh, do you know what? I can almost feel the heat. <laughs> the sun, the smell of the barbecue, yeah. the sound of the lawnmowers going. That's when you know it's summer, don't you? Yeah. Eight o'clock in the morning when somebody's got their yeah. lawnmower and you're like, oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. TM, TA 34825 carats in total. 18 millimetres in size. Individually, these would look fab in exactly the same way that we said earlier on. Perhaps just one long drop in a chain. Yeah. Earrings, I'm thinking with these as well. They're not, I mean, it's obviously collectively they are very, very weighty, but they wouldn't be too heavy. Just no, you could have maybe have a, le a little length of chain, maybe an inch of chain, and then that, that gorgeous yeah. 18 mil drop. Maxi dress. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Gosh, it's December the 30th. <laughs> DM DA 34 16 pounds and 95 pence and I like the idea with the the rounds as well of having that kind of swirl of wire yeah. around there <laughs> 800 six double four six double five for 825 cats a massive massive well done if you managed to get those uh julian west six mazza's back in joy denise barbara uh lynn in north york sandra's there elizabeth's just checked out as well congratulations uh maureen's in gail melissa's there as well so many of you coming through for these so well done 30 day money back guarantee you're the first people to get these home and do remember as well that you're all making jewelry um, you can enter your pieces into the Wall of Fame, which I think is an amazing competition. Bearing in mind we have it every week. It's not like, you know, it once in a blue moon. Um, it is every single week. So you can enter every single week if you want to. If you're making the jewelry pieces, you may as well. Just send your jewelry designs into studio at jewelrymaker.com. Uh, Lynn in Oxfordshire says, Hi team, loving the show. My new year's resolution is to start selling my jewellery in 2019. Do you have any resolutions? Alan. Um, do you know what? 
to start selling jewellery is absolutely brilliant. The stories we've had here at Jewellery Maker of people that have, well, in fact, most of our guest designers yeah, yeah, started I, out as a hobby. When I first watched Jewellery Maker, I did I had never made jewellery really, apart from maybe some earrings when I was like a kid or something. Look yeah, and uh, look at me now and I sell my jewellery. It's brought me so far. Yeah, it's amazing. And, and so we hear that so many times, not just from our guest designers, but from our customers that come in on workshops as well. So do let us know how that goes. Have you got any news resolutions, Katie? No, I don't tend to make them. I break them too quickly. It's best not yeah, to make them. Yeah, I just, I, I always, every year, I have this idea of a new year's resolution of thinking, I'm just going to stop complaining because we, we do it so easily. And then something may happen in your life and you think, what am I moaning about? Like, I've got nothing to complain about. But then, before you know it. Yeah, I have just told Lucy that I do want to try silversmithing this year. But Ooh. I probably won't get around to doing it. But I will, I'll try. That would be good. Yeah, I've said it now, haven't I? So. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, remember that one. Um, have you got any New Year's resolutions, Leah? More holidays. More holidays. Oh, now, that is a really good New Year's <laughs> resolution. I might just pinch that one. Uh, Becky? Just that one. Adam. Oh yeah, of course, cool. sorry, we have had this conversation. <laughs> yeah, I told you, Hannah, earlier on, Spanish. <laughs> Spanish, she's learning Spanish. So are you quite fluent now, Adam? Is there anything you can teach us? See. Si. Um, I'm not very good. Becky says, can you say this strand is nice? <laughs> it's not very good. Um, if you'd like to let us know what your news resolutions are, if you have any, 60777, start your message with the word J and see anything else. I just want to have a chat. Now these are polished. Um, all the other strands were frosted. These ones are polished. So if you do want that more glossy appearance with your gemstones, fabulous. I always think, when I think of um, strands like this, just simply you know, re-stranded. It makes me think of Hollywood icons. Yes, yes. You know, because that is kind of classically what Elizabeth Taylor and Marilyn Monroe and Audrey Hepburn would be seen wearing, Those whether it be pearls length. or shells yeah. or whatever. Yeah, just a really nice, big, chunky uh, beaded necklace. 500 and 40 carats in total you have in your rounds. 14 millimetres in size, you've got 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28 individual gemstones. So these ones are 14 millimetres. We've had uh, 18 millimetres in size. We've had your nuggets at 20 by 15. We've had your fasted squares at 18. Um, what size were the rounds? 18 were they? 18, yes, yeah. 18. So these ones 14. So perhaps if the 18 mil is a little bit uh, on the large side for you, you want something a little bit smaller. Perfect. These are. And do you know what? It's only four millimeters. But when you look at the two side by side, it is actually amazing yeah. how much bigger they appear. You know, with just four millimeters, that's quite a difference, actually multi-stranded maybe not the whole strands because i'm thinking of weight there but i'm just thinking that the sizes together and look really the nice. different textures as well yeah yes. well that would really really work well wouldn't it kz yeah. ta45 is your code for these ones 11 pounds and 95 pence for you this evening well done if you have checked out already remember you've got one postage that's it until midnight tonight that order is open unless you ask us to close it and um, it will stay open which means you can keep adding to that one order and only pay you one p and p of just three pounds and 95 pence if you do want to upgrade you can get it a little bit quicker if you're impatient like me i want everything yesterday uh 5.95 on your premium delivery and i think it is it's oh is it three to five working day standards and two to four premium uh, KZTA45 is your code for those. A massive well done if you've managed to check these out this evening. Uh, do get your texts in as well. 60777, start message with the word James. Do anything you like, really. Uh, there's a lot of um, lot of New Year's ones going on, obviously. Ah, uh, Jane in a minute, love. Um, Jane says, evening, lovely ladies. My New Year uh, resolution is to be happy, have better health, look after my friends and family, move house, appreciate life. Love to Jane. Oh. Oh, happy new year, Jane. Lots of positive... I like that, positivity. Yeah. Uh, Carol, uh, just to be healthy and happy. Yeah. Do you know, I think a lot of people do have that, don't they? Like, 
It's not until you, you, you're poorly that you realise, you know, that you should actually really, really yeah. appreciate your health. Be, and we just be more positive about yeah. everything. Yeah. Yeah. Um, lucky, love. Oh, oh, this is a different message. Lucky, lovely ladies, just tuned in after one week. Got JM, missed you all. Can't wait to see Katie's oh. jewellery. She's always fabulous. Oh, thank you, Jane. Oh, tell me, Jane. In Men at Law, which I'm pretty sure is France. Yes. South of France ish. Where the check? Weather check. Yeah, weather check. I think it's south. Uh, Adam's going with 15 degrees. Have you already checked, Adam? Are you cheating? I'll go for Ooh. 11. Oh, uh, Lucy's going with 8. Katie's going with 11. Mm. 7. Leah. It's night time. I'm going to go with 12. Eight degrees. Who won that one? Le Lucy. Oh. Lucy. She won there. She is. Take a bow, Lucy. Yes. <laughs> Eight degrees. Our Jane a minute law. It's about the same here, actually, I think, at the moment. Yeah. Not too shabby, is it? <laughs> uh, um, oh, it's lovely to have you text in. Jane is a very regular viewer here at Jewelry Maker. She is pretty much always there on the call screen. What do we think it is here? Do you know what? I didn't look when I drove it, neither, and I normally do. Um, here, I'm going to go, I think it was 10 today, so now I'm going to say about 8. I'm going to go 5. Six. Leah's going 6. 10 degrees. <laughs> Positively mild, isn't it? God, I'm going to get the uh, summer duvet out again. That's steady on. Uh, well done if you managed to get that one right here. Yeah. Have a look. Um, I'm being told that lots of you need to check out for those. There are huge amounts in baskets right now, so just make sure that you check out. Oh my gosh. Look at me. Oh, I spied these earlier. Oh, is this the one? This is the one that I can't say. <laughs> I'm going to try and say it once. And then I'll leave the pronunciation up to you oh, I need to see it first on screen Salama Lane it is a silent P because it has an S next to it Adam don't try and trick me Salama Lane Salama Lane uh, 280 carats check this out this is just, I love these. They are so individual and unique, aren't they? Really, really beautiful. They're natural. Oh my goodness me. Do you know, it really does remind me of, um, it's like art, isn't it? You it know, is. like, it's almost like, it's almost like the ink has gone in. Do you know what? Yeah, it's like sort of um, like a Japanese painting or something yeah. like that. Yeah. They're amazing. It can contain a blend of white chalcedony or white quartz. Um, and those uh, inclusions that you can see there are black dendi dendritic. Oh, there's lots of big words for this time of night. Lots of dendritic <laughs> inclusions. That's what you're seeing. So very much like your, um, you know, your dendritic, <laughs> dendritic opal and dendritic agate as well. Wow, um, they are really, really beautiful, aren't they? Oh, I, lo I love gemstones like this, where you just don't get to the same. And look at the colours of them as well. It's like a print, you know, um, you know, a stamp, a rubber yeah, stamp. Yeah, like, like a screen print or something yeah. like that, but it's not, it's perfect and natural. Wow, can you imagine? I love that square. If we were guaranteed that shape, I'm thinking now, if we were guaranteed this yeah. shape, I might be tempted to multi-buy enough just to do a small, like, all side the, table. All the shapes are amazing. They are, aren't they? Yeah. Can you imagine, like, if you were to, li literally, like, tiles, I'd, li I'd love to cover, like, a little side table, and then maybe oh, cover the top yeah, in, resin in resin so that you've yeah. got them set into a table. They are just... I think that one's my favourite. Which I one's your favourite? This one here. That one. <laughs> That's amazing, isn't it? 280 carats in total you've got there. BQVR83. 
three really different. and actually they they're quite rough to the touch as well so i'm thinking in terms of wire work yeah it's going to give you that would make grip. it quite easy yeah yeah, yeah. it's going to give you that grip so the, so the smooth wire is going to grip against mm. against the texture of how it. would you set them katie do you think? i think i'll probably prong set them because yeah. you wouldn't want to un interrupt the actual beautiful detail on the fronts mm. of those some of them look very blue as well, don't they? Some of them yeah. look blue, and then some of yeah, them have got the more caramel colours. Yeah, these ones look more bluey, don't they? I think these ones are my favourite, just because of the the delicate markings. It's literally like a tree. It's like it's a like piece a of fern, art, isn't, isn't it? it? Yes! It's like a fern. Oh, it's lovely. Oh, 800, 644, 655. So with this one, it is a multi-shape pack. So we cannot guarantee the number or the shapes and sizes that you'll get, but we're guaranteeing the carrot way with this. So this one, I mean, you know, you very rarely get squares in packs as well. Um, triangular shapes, we don't very often get those either. But maybe multi-buy, you know, if your budget will allow you to multi-buy, get a couple of packs, pick your favourite pack, send the other one back. If that is something you want to do, uh, please feel free to do so. I quite like this as well. I think I might set it that way. It's almost like a bit teardroppy the other yeah. way. Well, actually, it's quite wing like now yeah isn't it yeah so I've got one, two, three, four, five, six individual cabochons in this pack. You may get more of them at smaller sizes. You may get less of them at larger sizes. Oh, 0800, six, triple four, six, triple five. Is this the first time we've seen this at JM? They launched on Christmas Day. I've never seen I've them ne I've before. Never seen them. Really unique. I would imagine, again, you know, if you're somebody that does like nature and your earthy tones yeah. and colours. I mean, you've got the best of both worlds. You've got the earthy tones, and because you've got that tree-like appearance um, with those dendritic inclusions, you do have the best of both worlds. I'm normally in bed by now, Becky. Uh, BQ VR 83 is your code 0800-644-655 or on the web at jewelrymaker.com. Now, remember, you've got a 30-day money-back guarantee. If you haven't seen them before, get them home. They are... It's definitely... I mean... 14 years nearly in the gemstone industry. I've never seen this gemstone before. You're going to get people over to your craft stall and yes. asking. If you've got that something that's a bit different, you're definitely yeah. going to get. And once you get people over to your stall, other people are thinking, well, what are they looking at? And mm. you, you know, you draw a crowd. Yeah, absolutely. They are beautiful. Well done if you manage to get those. Gorgeous. Um, right, now just bear with us. I'm going to have to jump out of my seat. Um, oh, I tell you what, there's some lovely cabochons there as well. Oh, look at those! Sorry, Beth. Massively distracted, number two. And number 15, and number 16. Uh, which one's sorry, lovely? 21. Uh, I do beg your pardon. Just have to move that. That's my fault. I did move it earlier on and forgot to push it back. Oh, no. Oh, no. It <laughs> I'm stuck! <sighs> There we go, I'll be back in the room. <laughs> Have a look at these. Oh my gosh. Oh, wow. um, do you remember earlier on when I had that strand of carnelian? And I said you very rarely get many of those tones in fire opal. You can see here there's just the odd few, isn't there, of the darker oranges and the reds. It's because that colour commands a big, big price tag. It's some of the most sought after in your fire opal. Um, those really deep burning orange tones. That is just so beautifully graduated, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, there's no way you would you would interrupt that. I'd have to keep that as it is. Look at the sparkle from them as well. They're so sparkly. They are phenomenal. Um, with Opal, you know, for me again, before I worked in the gem industry, it kind of... For me, Ethiopian opal or your classic Australian opal, the white Australian opal with your play of colour, that's what I always think about. But there are so many varieties of opal. It is unbelievable. And this particular variety, it's not about play of colour. It's about the base colour and the diaphanity of the gemstone. So the diaphanity is basically the transparency um, of the gemstone. And what that does is it just allows enough light into the gemstone to create that beautiful, beautiful inner glow. They are, oh dear, oh no. <laughs> that, is, that is the curse of Hannah Stewart on The Late Show, I'm telling you now. <laughs> Honestly, every Late Show I think I've come off air early 
for one reason or another, whether somebody's gone down, the crew member's gone down, or uh, <laughs> something's happened with a wire or a plug or something. I thought that was it then, Adam. I thought that was it. Um, 22 <laughs> carats of your Mexican fire opal. <laughs> Thank you. Adam says, all right, very professional. I'll sort it out. You leave it with me. 22 carats of Mexican fire opal. 22 carats. Wow. Natural Mexican fire opal. <laughs> less than a pound per carat. Less than a pound a carat. Mm. That is unbelievable value. What would you do with your strand case? Because would, this is I like... Restrand. Just yeah. restrand exactly how it is. Mm. Add sterling silver clasp, maybe a little, tiny bit of chain just at the back. <sighs> And just, just and I, I would probably keep it for myself because it's beautiful. Yeah, I don't think I could part with this one to be honest. And this did the totally the epitome of summer for me, yes. Mexican fire opal. You know, Serengeti sunsets, beautiful sunshine. Oh eight hundred six double four six double five. Get your certificate of authenticity with this one. It is well worth doing. It's only an extra twenty five pence if you add it to your order, and you can print them off free of charge at the website as well, www.joymaker.com. If you're printing them off, why not print off all the ones that you need and laminate them as well have them on your craft stall uh, we did at one point have some um kind of craft bag type folders which were perfect for authenticity cards actually so um uh, perhaps just take them with you especially when you're passing on deals and especially you know not just passing on deals but when you have rare gemstones like this they're not easy to come by so people will want to know where you've got them from um out of curiosity to check that they're getting what you say they're getting and you know it, if somebody springs up out of nowhere with all these amazing rare gemstones and fantastic price tag you know even yeah. i would be asking a few questions i think um whoa again yeah, everyone in for uh, for those collectors collector in Shropshire, collector in london collector in kentucky okay Oh, where the check? But I, I'm rubbish at geography. Like I don't, literally, don't know where that is in that place. I'm not going to say where it is because I've got the wrong place. <laughs> Lucy's going for 14 degrees. See, I don't even know the time. The time difference is. I'm guessing it's morning. Kentucky time, 3:31 in the afternoon. Ooh. Oh, I'm going to go 17. 17, 19. I'm going 21. 20. Leah's playing it safe. Uh, you can't change, Lucy. <laughs> <laughs> That's not in the world. I said 21. Katie, you said 17. 17. 19, Adam. 20. Nine! Nine. In the day! Oh my gosh, why did I think it was? I see this is the thing I'm not very good at job. I don't yeah. actually know where it is. You know? I love that. Becky's like, America's normally hot. <laughs> is it Texas the area? It is a big old place, isn't it? Yeah. I I just don't know. Just don't know. Um that, that's that's probably like our weather then, pretty much, isn't it? 3 30 in the afternoon, nine degrees. Although we are slightly warmer. <laughs> It's nowhere near Texas. <laughs> Becky's geography is worse than mine. <laughs> Brilliant. 140 carats. Every day is a school day here at Joy Maker. That's a bird. It's an eagle. Oh, Look at that. Wow. A Pegasus. Oh my gosh. I love this. I absolutely love it. With all of these cabochons that we have that have different markings on yeah. them that are so, so incredible. 140 carats of your thunder egg agate. Now, um, nodule like rock you've got here, very similar um, to the opal. Do you remember the window opals that we had? So you've got like that rhyolite that the gemstone is in. So you've almost got this little window uh, that's very similar to like a filmed geode, if you like. There, um, look at that, look at that there's one. your stairway. You stairway up to everyone's saying heaven. I don't want to say that. Uh, <laughs> it does not measure. They are honestly. It's Mother Nature's artwork, yeah. isn't it? It's exactly just what I was going to say. Absolutely yeah. incredible. It really is. Um, I do mention this quite a lot, and it's purely because I'm very much into my art. Um, I do love my artwork. I do go to lots of galleries and, and uh, look at um, work and um, auction houses as well. 
And I do have a friend actually that I did put it on Instagram very recently. Um, she recreated, it was almost like, I want to say like, it reminded me of Jasper. You know, like the markings you get in Jasper. She did it with acrylic paints and stuff. So kind of recreated that look with paints and it looked amazing. It looked absolutely incredible. And I just look at these and I always think if you could, if you could just blow them up on mass, oh. have it on your wall. I mean, look at that. It's absolutely incredible, isn't it? Just phenomenal. 0800 644 655. Think is as well, Mother Nature has will not have produced this again. No, that is no. a one of a kind it's a gemstone. If, I love that. It's, it blows my mind. It really does. Nineteen pounds. They durable. And 95 pence for you. Now, I do have two, so we're giving you the carrot weight on this one. And it says multi-shape assortment. So in the picture that we have in the recording, there's three of them. You can see that they are completely different. If your budget will allow you to, I always, especially with cabbage stones like this, because like we all, as soon as we pick them up and as soon as we see them on screen, I'll have the director, the producer, um, you know, shouting in my ear, that's an eagle, that's a lion, that's a tiger, or I can see this, I can see that, I can see this. I always, um, and I do, I always see something straight yeah. away. Um, we see pictures in these cabbage stones. Yeah. yeah, it's just phenomenal. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you injured. Six double four. Six double five. <laughs> PJ VR one four. See, and actually, I think the mark, depending on what it looks like, I think you have to take that into consideration when it comes to prices yes, as price. well. Because, you know, let's say, for example, just throwing it out there, if you had an, a one that looked like an angel wing in one, yeah. that's going to be a more desirable yeah, it's, it's isn't got it? a niche market yeah. for that as well. So, yeah. you know, I think you've got to look at all of them and um, and take that into consideration. <gasps> oh, some more cabochons. In fact, could I, I would just... This is, this is exactly... What, the, these aren't these ones. I just want yeah. to show just because on the back of what I was just saying... This is what my friend more or less recreated with her acrylic paints. Uh, these cabochons here, these came up in a little while. It was all blues and greens. It's an incredible, incredible piece of art. They're gorgeous. Not yet, though. Have a look at these. Peter sight for you. Oh, oh wow. my gosh. Oh. That's oh, my favourite, too. That one. <laughs> look at these. Woo. <laughs> Look at these, Peter Sight, incredible, incredible jobs. So now, I'm really like, can I just ask where we're going on price, Beck? I'm just gonna ask you to say that again. The reason I wanted to check was because um, we did have uh, a pack of carrot shots. There was two, again, it was, you know, going by carrot weight, so it's, you know, uh, the number wasn't really relevant, but, I had two cabbage on the Peter site once upon a time and they were £185 and this, I have brought this up a couple of times because that to me is perfectly normal, £185 for, for the, the cabbage ones that we had. But since then we've had a couple that have been really low in price and I think we've messed up a little bit here. You know, very. I've said it before. I'll be completely honest with you. I don't think these should be anywhere near where we are going for you tonight. If you love your gemstones, if you love your one of a kind, that is what you have with gemstones like this. You really do have something that is so individual and so unique. How many people outside the jewelry maker family do you know that own this gemstone? I there really, that probably isn't yeah. many at all. I own one, because I haven't bought it. I bought yeah. it before we started selling it, and it's a pear shape. It's probably about a third of the size of this one. Really? Yeah, and I paid £30 for it. Good. But still, that's good. Yeah. I mean, that is a great price tag. You know, 30, like, if you said to me, oh, should I buy this? I would say, yeah, because that yeah. is a fantastic price tag. It really is. It's not a gemstone that, generally speaking, uh, comes very affordable. Now, the pack there, um, in fact, my mum bought some Peter Sight, and she had a pack very similar to that. She had one that had the lovely blues and the grays in. That is, in fact, if you have ever... Um, 
So the, the acrylic art, you know the paint, basically um, what you do is you, <laughs> I don't know you guys what I'm talking about. If you put the, the paint in, so I don't know how to do it because I've actually never done it, but this is what my friend told me from what, the picture that she made for me. You put, when you put the paint in, it creates a reaction. I think and I've so, seen videos. Yeah, like, yeah. and so you, the, when you put the paint in, it kind of creates this reaction. You get these natural swirls within the paint. So actually, as an artist, I would imagine that would be quite easy to do because yeah. it does all the work for you. That's what that reminds me of. Again, it was those yeah. swirls. 135 carats, that's beautiful. Um, and then that one, the other one, the more, it's quite, um, it reminds me of lions and tigers. Yes. That hue, that kind of caramelly so warm, amber. Yeah. yeah, gorgeous. So you might get two that are very different uh, in their colours. But you may get some like this that actually are not too dissimilar from each other in their colours. You've got this one here that's got a real little splash of turquoise in it as well. I don't know if you can see that on camera there. But a little splash of turquoise in there. ME VR13, £19.95. What's that all about? £19.95. How much would you sell one of those for, Katie? See, this, this is where I do get why um, customers pass on their deals. Yeah. Because now I'm thinking, have I overshot it? Think where I thought I was originally going to go with one, selling one of these and knowing that we've had them at £185 before, well into three figures. I don't know where I'd go and price. This one, if I did quite an ornate wirework setting around that and finished it off really, really beautifully, then I'd probably be around about 90 Yeah, see, I think, again, I think you kind of have to do the gemstone justice, don't yes. you? You know, yes, we've got amazing prices, but again, this is something that is so rare and so unique. And I, I've always said, you know, I think to have something that nobody else on the planet has, you know, whether it be an item of clothing off the catwalk by Versace or, you know, D&G or whoever, it could have cost you tens of thousands of pounds. If it be a painting that is a one of a kind, you know, it could be tens of thousands of pounds. To have a one of a kind, we've got three here, so what's that, uh, less than seven pounds per cab? Wow. One of a kind. I love it. I absolutely love it. M E B R one three. Massive, massive well done if you've managed to get those. I actually don't have any pizza site yet, and I really. Oh, I can see a face in that one now. Do you see that face? Oh, yeah. A bit like a monkey. Isn't <laughs> 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 Just suddenly, as I looked at it at a different angle, I just saw a little face. Can you see him at the top there? No, I don't think you can see him on the screen. Isn't I can it see strange? You. I can kind of see it on screen, but it doesn't look like a, mini, a monkey anymore. It looks like a man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gosh. Yes, I send her home. <laughs> right. Yes, 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 <gasps> Becky. Oh, my gosh. Um, I have three of these strands now <laughs> when i bought them i bought them with the intention of sending two back i didn't God, oh my gosh oh, this is absolutely epic have look at that green paraba look at that one oh, my wow. goodness me and um, in fact a must correct myself it wasn't this particular strand i've just noticed these are the rough slices mine were polished but very very similar um in its strand that you had these slices of tourmaline now this strand is predominantly green there's a lot of incredible green tourmaline in there you got some pinks in there as well um every strand is going to be different and this is the reason that i did originally multi-buy was because in some strands you will get those paraba colors in some strands you will get those indicolite tourmaline colors and there's just no telling every strand is going to be completely different that is why i multi-bought specifically because i wanted to look for those indicolite hues and i wanted to look for those paraba hues it might be the pinks that you love in your tourmaline as well 62 carats, 5 by 2 to 13 by 4 millimeter. Look at the size of these. They are huge. 
The carrot weight for tourmaline, I mean, individually, that one in the centre there, well, the two, the, the, the bright green and the darker bottle green one that you've got there as well, they've got to be, you know, a good few carrots per gemstone. Exactly. And, you know, I have in the past sold jewellery pieces um, that have been way in the high three figures. I've sold some one of a kinds that have been well into four figures uh, of tourmaline as well. It is a very rare and very, very sought after gemstone in the gem industry. <clears throat> there are a lot of people actually... Uh, particularly with tourmaline here at Jewelry Maker that do come in and buy tourmaline uh, not to necessarily make jewellery with um, but just to keep just to collect because you can't pick these gemstones up everywhere and I think we all kind of forget that we're so used to them now um, and, and very kind of um, well, it's just what we expect now because we're jewelry makers, that's what we do. But actually, you know, you try and look anyway. If you go onto a search engine now and, and just type in 62 carats of multicolored tourmaline will you find a strand in fact the, the first place it will probably direct you to is jewelry maker um, we do find that a lot when we do google searches that jewelry maker is top um but you know you can't just get 62 carats of tourmaline anywhere especially not at these prices what i love about what we do is the fact that massive mistake <laughs> Direct and panning is that's what your microphone had gone then, but your batteries had run out. I think mine have. Nine pounds and ninety-five pence. I don't get I just any any one of those two there exactly how I want to set mine, I haven't yet done it. Um, but um, with my particular strand, I've got my gold-plated sterling silver featherweight head pins because the drill holes are quite small on these. And I'm just waiting now for the right gold-plated 95 chain. Yeah. And I just want one sat in the little nuzzle just, of yeah, your neck just line. One. That's or just how I want one mine. in a ring, maybe. Imagine. Yeah. But imagine, Katie, if you did that in sterling. I mean, imagine that on a designer <sighs> website. You, um, you know, you'd be talking hundreds and hundreds yeah. of pounds. You could be easily. But, you know, I'd sell that. It's tourmaline, and that's a significant carrot. I couldn't sell that, I don't think, for anything under £50 for that no, one gemstone. Absolutely. I couldn't. Again, I'm not telling you that's where you have to price yours. Um, it is entirely up to you. However, just remember that you are looking at an incredibly rare gemstone. Far, far rarer than most people even realise with this gemstone. We don't have tourmaline every day here at Jewelry Maker, and we certainly don't have 62 carats at nine pounds and 95 pence i'd be multi buying socks off this how many of those do we have there can i get any of these okay we've got a three figure quantity i'm gonna get that in fact can i just say um i hadn't pointed out the tassels i would quite happily buy those as earrings off of your craft store for the price of the strand they're so on trend yeah. at the moment. Yeah, so on trend. <laughs> Adam says, all right, deal done. <laughs> He's going to buy the strand and sell me the tassels. Right. Um, what should be in there? Those are the ones I got out. Oh. Oh, I love these. Look at these. Aren't these a much? Just keep thinking, can I have that picture? Can I show you that picture? Am I allowed to show my friend's picture? Leah says yes. Well, I just want to show you how amazing it is. And this is why I, I talk about it so often. <laughs> just checking my Instagram. Um, it is on there somewhere. Let's have it. There it is. Look. So we've had some. Oh, I better just uh, hide yeah. some stuff on there. Can you see? Can you see? We've had so many cabochons like that, especially, particularly with the uh, Shatakai as well. I love it. Absolutely love it. See, look, I love it. It's amazing, isn't it? Um, so I've got two. Two, are we guaranteed to get two as well? But we can't guarantee the shape on this one. So that one, they are really different. So in that one on the recording, you've seen a lot more of the turquoises, aren't you? That kind of reminds me of Fabergé. The, yeah. the, um, that, that the markings on that one as well. It's making me think Fabergé with that one. That's exactly the reason that I would multi-buy if I could. 
me personally i prefer the pack on the recording to this pack here these are incredibly beautiful and if you love your blues these are definitely going to be your favorites but there's more going on in the others for me yeah. you know See, I, I like this one yes it's personal yeah. preference isn't it we're all so different i love the shape I of this one shape. actually yeah, yeah. Shape definitely in this one. Uh, so here I've got like um, uh, a rectangle, and this is a fancy shape, really fancy shape. Almost, I want to say pebble-like with that shape. Actually, that reminds me of like a, a lightning bolt. Yeah, lightning bolt over the sea. Eight hundred six double four six double five. Tiredness, it's tiredness. <laughs> That's what it is. Fourteen pounds and ninety-five pence. Oh eight hundred six double four six double five on the web at jewelrymaker.com. I need to get these. <laughs> Leah, you can go and have a giggle. Up a chuckle. Fourteen pounds and ninety-five pence for you. Massive. Well done if you manage to get them. <coughs> Righty ho. I don't know what. I've just realised that Adam actually is very professional because I don't think he laughed. <laughs> no. No. I didn't laugh. Pearls. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh. <gasps> Oh, look at those. Oh. <laughs> look at these. Um, I'll just hold them end to end uh, so you can see exactly the drops that you get on the strand as it is. <laughs> really? <laughs> Four by five millimetres. In size, a 38 centimetre strand you have there. They, for me, are the perfect size for layering up. Um, I did see a design many, many moons ago now. I think it was like Pinterest or something like that. Uh, there was like um, a strand of pearls and a feather charm on there. And then a gold chain just by itself. And then there was another gold chain with a, I think it was like a jade eye or it was a green gemstone there. And I wouldn't normally layer pearls up with, like other metals and stuff like that but it just looks so nice it looked really really pretty and these are the perfect size for doing that um you don't always want the big rounds the big perfectly round seven millimeter eight nine ten millimeter pearl depending on what you are doing you know it might be um uh, that you work with cinema and you're doing um you know a hair piece you're not yeah. going to put your big seven mil round in no, there you want no, something, you want something lighter. lightweight yeah, yeah and these are perfect for that aren't they really really pretty multi-stranded designs as well we've had some fantastic um like uh what do we call them you know like the bracelet connectors the multi-looped kind yeah, of yeah the cuff sort of yeah style. the multi-stranded yeah. connectors we've had some lovely ones especially with the cz as well as a Bridal piece. Great in Shibori. Perfect size yeah. for Shibori. Absolutely. SGDP73 is your code. 800 644 655. Wow. See, now I'm thinking Christmas cash. Imagine, imagine. Um, I didn't. See, you find that when you have kids, you'll get this character. When you have kids, you don't get the £10 of Auntie Maureen anymore. No. Your children get the £10 of Auntie Maureen <laughs> in the post. Um, but if you haven't got any Christmas cash, I think if someone's giving you a tenner, and it's so easy, I think, when you're a little bit older, to spend it on living. Yeah, because if you, if you put it in your purse... You just spend it. Just, it. Yeah, yeah, it just goes, yeah, doesn't it? it but else. imagine if they say to you, oh, you know, do you get anything nice with your money? some pounds. Only gave you ten pounds. Yeah, I know. 
and I had change. £7.95. That's a great, I think that'd be lovely yeah. to buy something like this. Um, perhaps restrand them, perhaps not them. Add a class. That could be a family heirloom piece of jewellery. Imagine how fabulous that would be actually to show the person that has given you yeah. that money and say, well, yeah, this is, this is what I bought with my tenner. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, 800. Oh, I see Adam. I like that. Adam says, buy it, make two bracelets and give one to them. Yes, that's a really nice idea. SGDP73, it's your code 0800 644. I don't actually have an auntie Maureen. I, 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 I just plucked that name out of the air. <laughs> SGDP73, 0800 655. Massive well done if you managed to get those. Pearls will work with anything as well. Oh, we see you've got that classic white colour there. So really, really versatile. I'm a bit of a creature of habit with pearls again. There's only certain things I will put them with. I'm not, yeah. I don't tend to put them with everything. It's like, well, I maybe might add some microfasted black spinel in there as spacers for a classic monochrome look. But other than that, I'm pretty. Yeah, with for me, think... pearl, pearls with pearls. Yeah, yeah or, nothing, or maybe yeah. a sapphire, or maybe a single yeah, ruby, a single, you know, sticking yeah. like with your regal designs, yeah. if you like. And the seven pounds, I'm going to get this strand. I do have some Christmas cash left, and before I spend it on milk bread yeah. or anything else equally as boring, <laughs> no, not milk bread, milk <laughs> or bread, <laughs> or uh, I don't know, petty for Lou, something like that. <laughs> <laughs> SGGP, you can get something called milk loaf, can't you? Yeah, you can. Yeah, my nan used to have that. It's the it's like round, round one. Obviously, yeah. it makes lovely toast. That does. Mm. I need to get. Oh, my God. <laughs> Please don't tell anybody I said that. <laughs> oh, I'm, going out. I'm going out tomorrow night. STDP 7. It makes lovely toast. Oh, my gosh. Honestly. <laughs> <gasps> Becky, oh. where is this going on price? This is so high-end. This has got to be. She's just going to double-check for me. This is the best strand of ametrine I've ever, ever seen here at Jewelry Maker in terms of quality, the cut, the clarity on these is just phenomenal. Oh my gosh, how fabulous is this strand? I love it. It's coming up for you after the break. So is the second kit and your second demonstration. Don't go anywhere, I'll be back in a few. Watch us on Freeview. We have some very exciting news to share with you. From Monday the 7th of January 2019, Jewelry Maker will be on Freeview HD 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Please be aware that if you have an HD Freeview TV, you'll need to retune from 1 p.m. on the 7th to take advantage of this to ensure you don't miss out on any jewelry making goodies. If you're in an area that doesn't have HD coverage, but you have a connected TV, don't panic. You can still watch JM by going to channel 73, where you'll find our sister channel, Sewing Quarter. Simply click on the red button, and this will give you the option to watch JM all day. Don't forget you can also view Jewelry Maker on Sky, Virgin, Freesat, and the fastest way to shop with us is online at jewelrymaker.com. Or download the Jewelry Maker app. Tune in from Monday the 7th of January for 24 hours of Jewelry Maker on Freeview HD. Welcome to Jewelry Maker. We are part of the Immediate Media family. Immediate Media is a fast-growing multimedia platform company who operates some of the most loved brands across the UK. Our brands range from our other shopping TV channel, The Sewing Quarter, to our very successful magazines, such as Simply Knitting, Molly Makes, and The Radio Times. We work incredibly hard to inspire you and bring you lots of exciting ideas and projects. So whatever your creative needs, you know that our crafting family will be there for you. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Buying with Jewelry Maker online couldn't be easier. Just head over to our website, jewelrymaker.com, and click on the register link. Simply fill in the required fields and you can shop 24-7. You'll also be privy to a faster checkout and personalised offers. 
Jewelry Maker, your one-stop shop for all your jewelry making needs. Did you know that when you book a Jewelry Maker workshop, you're given exclusive access to our Jewelry Maker shop? You can browse through special items and offers, be privy to selected discounts and deals that you can't get at any other time. Shop whilst you learn and grab yourself some amazing offers. For more information on workshops and available dates, contact our call centre. Wake up and tune into Jewelry Maker every morning at 8am for our early bird special. We have some great offers, amazing deals and great prices to bring to you. So that's 8am every morning and you know what they say, the early bird catches the worm. Owning a strand of genuine gemstones is always exciting, but being able to use it in your handcrafted jewellery, then passing it on to its new owner with proof of its authenticity is even more incredible. Why not add one of our printed authenticity cards to your order and share that same feeling with your customers? You can also access online authenticity certificates through items you have previously ordered by looking at your order history on your account details. The certificate gives you valuable information about your purchase and is your guarantee of quality and peace of mind from Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Welcome back. If you're just tuned into Joy Maker, I've got one more hour with you and the most spectacular, spectacular strand of Amatrine I have. Well, I am very excited now because whenever I pick up a strand, I kind of have a price point in my head where I think it, it should be going. And with this strand, there is no denying that this is a high-end strand. You've got amazing consistency of colour, you've got amazing clarity, the cut on every single gemstone is, oh my gosh. I mean, it's perfect, absolutely perfect. Now, I think, um, I think a lot of our Rondell strands, I'm trying, are they graduated or have I just made that up completely? I don't know. I think a lot of them are graduated sometimes, so you don't often get to see that actual consistency end to end. But with this strand, it's like, see, I think with the Rondale strands, sometimes not every single gemstone is exactly the same in terms of fasting, because it doesn't have to be, if you like. Whereas with your microfaceted strands, every single one is exactly the same, and you can see that consistency throughout the strand. This is like that. It's like, uh, it's one of the most high-end strands. Well, it is the most high-end strand of, of Amatrine I have ever seen here at Jewelry Maker. This is gemstone quality and some, you know? Sometimes we have Amatrine uh, that may look uh, slightly included. We may call it bead quality. We bring you a lot of bead quality here at Jewelry Maker. But we do also bring you gemstone quality and phenomenal prices with that gemstone quality. So I had a price tag in my head for this strand. And Becky was looking and she told me on the break where this was going, which was already lower than the price tag I had in my head. And then as we came back from the break, Becky said, that was a lie. I said, what was a lie? That price. It's not the price. I don't, I literally have no idea where this is going now and it's made me very, very nervous. Uh, I, I don't know. She says, do you want to know? I don't know if I do. Okay, so Becky's going to turn my switch off, which is what they can do in the gallery, and she's just going to tell Katie and not me. I'm looking at your face then. Oh, my word. I want to know now. Do you? Yeah, she's not telling me now. Oh, pick up the phone, seriously. I think uh, Lucy's just put all the cups and saucers <laughs> yeah. down. I'm picking up the phone. Yeah. And um, 170 carats. This is natural. <gasps> this makes it worse. Like, good for you. That 
that's amazing. That's incredible. Okay, so now we're looking at, because we have seen a lot of treated ametrine strands lately. Um, again, nothing wrong with treatments. However, a natural gemstone will, you know, generally be more than your treated gemstones in terms of prices. This is natural. Now, it's formed deep below the Earth's crust, whereby during its chemical formation, hotter temperatures meet cooler temperatures. Now, it's the hotter temperatures that give us the citrine hues and the cooler temperatures that give us the amethyst hues. Too much heat in that formation and the entire gemstone would just be citrine. You'd just be looking at a strand of citrine. Colour. The colour split across the strand. The clarity. The sparkle. The faceting. There isn't anything I would change about this strand at all they are huge gemstones eight by five millimeters look at that oh my gosh that for me katie is red carpet that's the Absolutely. kind of um that's the kind of strand i think you would see around the neckline of your hollywood a-listers yeah um and you'd see it in a magazine and you'd be thinking oh my gosh they either paid thousands for that or um, they've been given it by a designer and they've got to give it back at yeah. the end of the night. Or if it was for sale in the magazine or, you know, for the magazine, you, there would be no price tag. Yeah, You'd have to definitely. inquire. You can, and yeah. the thing is, you can imagine it. Imagine that on the necklace burst. That glossy magazine. Um, and I can, I can just imagine, like, you know, the designer, like Cartier yes. or, you know, proper big designer name. Um, next to this. Just look at that. I mean, you can imagine, in, in, in a boutique jewellers, would you ask the price tag if there was no price tag on there? No. I wouldn't, because we all have, we all do it, we all have that uh, kind of perceived value, if you like, whereby if something looks high-end and it doesn't have a price tag on it, we all assume it's going to be way out of our price range. Now, we are already at £49.95. Now, there are a lot of people checking out at this price tag. Now, I am just being told you need to dial now. How many do we have, Beck? Right. 77 chances is all we have. There will be collectors that multi-buy on this purely because of the price versus what we are getting. The price tag for a natural strand of ametrine, I mean, we shouldn't even be as low as 49.95. The price tag I originally had in my head was 69.95. This, this is a high-end strand, and it is, in my opinion, the best strand of ametrine that we've had here at Jewelry Maker. In my head, this was 69.95, sorry. Then Becky told me 49.95, I don't know, stop it. She's making me very, very nervous. 49. Oh <laughs> my. <laughs> wow. I'm going to need my Nana nightcap when I go home, I tell you. <laughs> 29 pounds and 90. That's natural. Uh, how is that? Do you know what? If we put that into a search engine now, if we put that into a search engine, 170 carats of ametrine, A, you're probably going to struggle to find anything that you... Can you imagine that in a boutique jewellers? No. I genuinely, <laughs> genuinely think that's going to be in four figures in a, yeah. in a boutique no. jewellers. I honestly, I would pay twenty nine ninety five for that. Yeah. The quality, the cut... Just look at... Abs, do you know, I know, I, section, I do have my yeah. contact lenses in and I know that they're for distance, not for close-up. But I genuinely, the facets are amazing. I can't see any inclusions. And, I, you know, I can't say that they're going to be flawless because they won't be. But that, for me, is the most gemstone quality strand of ametrine that we've had. And I genuinely would, I wouldn't have batted an eyelid if Becky had said to me, it's 129.95, that strand. I mean, if I was selling a pair of earrings... I would probably actually try and graduate them in colour. You know, I'd yeah. probably try and go for like an amethyst, then a bit of a mix, and then a citrine at the bottom. Three gemstones in each ear, absolute minimum of 95 sterling silver. I'd probably go gold plated because obviously it would really complement the citrine hues. 
I, I genuinely could not sell those for less than £50. Six gemstones. The quality that you are looking at here and the fact that they are natural, these have not been treated. From, again, the best location for this gemstone, Bolivia. It is also referred to as Bolivianite. So if you do ever see a gemstone called Bolivianite, it is exactly this. Look at the sparkle on those. I'd be tempted to multi-buy. And I know, you know, I do understand that that is a, not a price point that it's easy to multi-buy at. But do you know what? If that yeah. was my favourite gemstone... I think if you are somebody that sells, you buy that and you'll probably want to keep it for yourself. So I'd probably buy two just so that I could sell one and still keep one for myself. Egg, I do. Yeah. I, pff, honestly, that's unbelievable. I'm going to count them for you. I want you to know exactly what you're getting with this one. Um, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24... 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, 42, 44, 46, 48, 50, 52, 54, 56, 58, 60, 62, 64, 66, 68, 70, 72, 74, 76, 78, 80, 82, 84, 85. Adam says, I don't believe you. 85 gemstones, so 6 into 85. <laughs> 85 divided by 6. So 14 pairs of earrings I could make if I do what I just said. So 6 gemstones in each. It doesn't have to be 6, you could do less than 2, but I could make 14 pairs in the design that I was talking about. So 14 pairs, I'm just gonna say 50 pounds each to make the maths easy, uh, she says. That is like 700 pounds, 700 pounds. Obviously we're not gonna sell them all in one go, brilliant if you do, um, but I just think when you've got something like that that is, it, to me that's effortless, you know, it just, even if somebody is not familiar with this gemstone, I don't think they're going to be asking too many questions no. because you'd be so blown away by the beauty yeah. of that gemstone and a simple design. Yeah, imagine? or just three or five in a slider bracelet. Yeah, oh, yes, the slider bracelets that we have, beautiful. I really would just keep it that simple because it really doesn't need anything else building up around it. I don't it. think it's stunning, so. Just and and I wouldn't want to put that with anything else because I just want that strand to just be the, the centre of attention. It's, it's, I can't believe that price tag. I really cannot. A massive, massive congratulations to Liz in Kent. Uh, Wendy in Shropshire has got two. Linda in Yorkshire, Louise in Hertfordshire, Eileen in Suffolk, Taryn in West Yorkshire, Christine in Suffolk, Kay in Greater Manchester, Josephine in Herefordshire, Mary in Worcestershire, Carol in Bedfordshire, Anna in Essex, Jane in Men at Law, uh, Collect in Bridgend, Pat, Chesie in Merseyside, Collect in London, Francis, Zoe, Hilma, Jane, Pauline, you just need to check out and it will be yours. You'll have this home in a couple of days' time. Honestly, it's definitely standing out for me as one of the auctions of the evening. It's standing out as one of those that if you miss out on this, you're gonna kick yourself. That price tag is just too good to miss out on. Oh, oh my days. That's I can't believe that's 29.95. Honestly. Um, right, kit time. Look at this fuck look at these. Oh my gosh, three microfasted strands. That's making me think of Easter. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Little bunnies. Um, somebody said the other day, I don't know who it was, but they've seen Easter eggs in the shops already. Wow. Yeah. I mean, even for me, that's a bit much, you know? It's no wonder I've eaten like 50 of them by the time Easter comes around when they're in the shop so early. <laughs> Um, these are really, really beautiful. You have um, three strands, three microfaceted strands. You've got 10 carats of your peridot, 10 carats of peridot, 12 carats of your yellow quartz, and 8 carats of your rose quartz. Aren't they just so pretty? Um, just going back to what I was talking about with the, um, with the ametrine there, the consistency in the cutting how difficult it must be to cut every single one of those gemstones look at that jewelry my goodness me katie that is beautiful 
thank you. That's stunning. And and tassels, seed beads are perfect for tassels, aren't they? Because yeah. they're so on trend at the moment. Yeah, but having the gemstones as well just adds another dimension to it. Yeah, perfect. Look at that. <gasps> Splash of colour. <laughs> Splash, it's making me think of that song. You know that, uh, repeti, <laughs> oh, 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 that one. I saw the name and I couldn't think of what it was, I presumed it was like a, a funky song. That song, and it's uh, the video is brilliant as well. It's like a little plasticine man, it's brilliant. You haven't seen it, it's wicked. <laughs> Um, anyway, sorry. Uh, <coughs> we were just talking about the name of the kit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Casey, okay, those are so pretty. I love. I love. I haven't actually tried seed beading. Oh, um, I don't have a huge amount of time, and it is. You know, everyone will openly say it is a time-consuming medium. However, the result. I mean, even just that. I yeah, love that's just of threading braces. on some yeah. Anyway. yeah. This is the thing. It doesn't have to be, does it? Um, you know, an intricate weave or a pattern. No. It no. can just be simply threading and layering up. And I think, obviously, with this size as well, it's the perfect component to be to be able to do that as yeah. well. Um, so you've got 10 carats of your peridot microfaceted rounds, uh, 12 carats of your dyed yellow quartz and 8 carats of your rose quartz in there. You then have your seed beads as well. Uh, they're all delicate. You've got the matte metallic bronze, the opaque yellow ABs and the silver lined light green all in your size 11s there as well. It is a fantastic, fantastic combination of colour as well. I do think, and I said this yesterday, it's one of those, uh, it's the time of year isn't it, especially when Christmas is over. A lot of people get the post-Christmas blues. January and February feels like a very long time it before does. the spring comes. Yeah. And you, when you get there you're ready for it aren't yes. you? Um, so I kind of think that we all need that little bit of upliftment. Yeah, so working with these nice bright yeah. fresh colours, it, it kind of gives you a lift doesn't it? Definitely, really really pretty. 0800 644 655 or on the web today at jewelrymaker.com NKXC35 £27 and 95 pence for you this evening. Uh, do remember you've got a 30 day money back guarantee even on your kits as well. Uh, it is on absolutely everything here. So you've got 30 days to think about it. If you get this home and for whatever reason you change your mind, all you've got to do is send it back. It's a no quibble money back guarantee. NK XC35 is your code for this one. They are such a beautiful code. And I'm thinking Easter and spring, the greens and the yellows for daffodils yeah. in that as well. The rose quartz for your flowers. Yes. It's perfect, isn't it? And actually colours that you could mix in with everything else you've yeah, got in your stash. Yeah, it's going to work really well with the rest yeah, of your stash. Yeah, I love the ring. How pretty, wouldn't yeah. it? I don't, well, I guess, because I, uh, I'm not a seed beader, but I wouldn't necessarily think of making rings with seed yeah, beads. Yeah, the seed bead rings are really comfortable. comfortable yeah. Really, really comfortable. That's a really pretty design. Um, so you've made, Katie, one, two, three, four, five, six, pieces of jewelry did you have anything left i had in? lots of seed beads left yeah and i, I did I only had a few of the um the microfaceted yeah. left but i did use a lot in this bangle here because mm. it's all the way around so yeah. so pretty how long would you say the kit took you like to work on all of these um, pieces obviously i'm sort of stopping, stopping and starting, starting and things yeah. but it probably took me over a couple of days Wow, they're gorgeous. Really, really pretty designs. Um, 0800 644 655. Um, give it a go. If you've not tried seed beading before, the, the results that you can get are incredible. And again, as I say, it doesn't have to be um, an intricate weave, an intricate pattern that you start off with. You can start off with something really, really simple. And when you look at seed bead designs, sometimes you do look at them and think, oh, do you know what? I couldn't do that. But it is just following a pattern. You know, and yeah. once you get into the rhythm of it, it's, yeah, it's, it's, it's repeating, like, isn't yeah, it? It's like, like we say with chainmail, once you get that first bit yeah, done, yeah. it's just a pattern that repeats itself. Yeah, yeah of course. Yeah. Fantastic. So, uh, well done if you managed to check that one out. Uh, so what are you going to show so us? We're going to make the ring. Yeah. Yeah. So, so this ring, I have made it before in a bracelet form. Okay. It's the first time I've, I've done a ring with it. I'm going to do it in a different colour just because, uh, because of the silver lining in, in these 
the glare sometimes yeah. you can't okay. see. So Fabulous. I'm going to do it in, in this gorgeous chocolatey colour. Mm. Yeah, and the peridot, just so, so you can see what I'm doing. Yeah. And I'm using white thread. Probably if I was doing it in this chocolate colour, I probably would use the dark thread, right. but I thought you'd be able to see it a bit better. Okay, so I've got, it's, I usually go with like an arm's length of, of thread, okay. yeah, which is plenty for a ring. So what we're going to do is we're going to add, we're just going to add two to start with. So it's called a herringbone stitch. Okay. Okay, so we're going to start with adding two to our needle. I'm using a size 12 needle and I'm using the wildfire, which is the 0.15 millimetres. Okay. Right. So I'm just going to thread those down. I've got no stop bead on. Mm -hmm. So I'm just going to leave myself a little bit of a tail and then I'm going to come back around and through those two seed beads okay and what I want them to do is just sit next to each other so you might have to persuade them a little bit sit next to each other and then just come back up the first one again mm -hmm. okay so where the tail is come back up that one there and what you'll find is they will sit next to each other on the thread there so I've got two next to each other okay, okay? so now I need to work my way to the end of the opposite to the thread so I can continue working in this mm -hmm. direction okay so this first row I've added two and the next row I'm just going to add one so I've added my seed bead my delicate and I'm coming I'm exiting from here so mm -hmm. I'm coming back down that same one and then we want that one to sit next to that first that second one so now we've got three in a row we want to get in ourselves in a position to add the next one so we need to come back up there and pull that through so them three are now sat nicely next to each other and then we're going to add our last one and then cut exiting up at the top there and then coming back through that same bead and pulling that little bit tighter and then back down okay mm -hmm. right so now what I want to do is that because I've got my tail at the one side and my working thread at the same side what I want to do is actually work my way back up and down. So up this one, down the next one, just so that I'm working in opposite okay. directions. Okay, so if you were doing a brace that you'd probably do it a bit wider, you need to add multiples of, of two. Mm -hmm. So you need an even number. Okay. okay. So now we're going to start working on the herringbone. And what I do is I tend to work from right to left. Right. Okay, so I've just flipped that over. I'm holding my tail down here so it's out of the way. And from now on, I'm going to add two beads at a mm -hmm. time. So we're going to pick up two of the delicas, exiting this, this end one here, and then we're coming back down the next one. And pull that through. And what you'll find is this time they'll kind of sit at a, an angle with mm -hmm. each other, but that's the herringbone stitch. That's okay. What, that's what we want. Yeah. Okay, then we're going to come up the next bead and then add another two. See, the, this is uh, the most fiddly bits, that first yeah. bit where we've got, kind of got to hold on to everything. So add another two beads and back down that end one. And then what I do at this point is I turn it over. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now what I need to do is my thread's exiting at the bottom here and I need yeah. to get it up there. Right. So all I do is skip up the side. Now if you're using a dark coloured thread with this colour seed bead, you wouldn't see it at all. Yeah. But obviously you're going to be able to see it because I'm using the white. Okay. So all I've done is I've come up there and skipped up. So I've come up through this bead here and I'm going to add another two. And all I'm going to do is come down one section of beads. I'm not going to go right down to the bottom again. So down that next bead, let them sit nicely and then skip across up to the next ones and then adding another two and back down. You're going to continue doing this, just working on sort of adding a row, just adding to the next row underneath mm -hmm. it until you get to around about a third of the way around your, ri your ring. So Working it out, sort of as, as to ring size, is, is actually quite difficult, sort of thing. So what you need to do is kind of pop it against your finger and okay. kind of work it out so it's yeah. kind of sat in the middle at this side, right. and then so it's coming around to the mm -hmm. front here. But don't worry, I'd definitely say go a little bit shorter on this bit because it doesn't matter because the other side's going to be around the back, and yeah. you're just going to join them together at okay. the end anyway. They're just going to zip up. Okay. So once you get to that point. Just find the right ones. 
once we get to this point where we want to start adding our gemstones we've got all the way up in you can see that how that herringbone's built up there and I've skipped up to my next bead and I'm ready to add my next two so what we're going to do is we're going to widen it off a little bit so adding two back down just like we were doing previously pull that through but this time just to start winding it out a little bit we're going to add an extra seed bead mm -hmm. so where we just skip across with thread before we're going to skip across but we're adding that seed bead as okay. well okay so that's going to sit there in the middle then we're going to add two and back down th through that last seed bead turn it over and then back up ready to add our next row and to add the gemstones we're just going to do the exact same thing so we're going to add a seed bead then a gemstone then a seed bead and a mm -hmm. gemstone so that it gives us enough space to fit that gemstone in so this time I've added a peridot on there and up through that next delicate seed bead and that's just going to slot in there because we widened it a little bit okay yeah and then add our next two and back down so that's how you're going to add your seed beads mm -hmm. and, your, and your, delic uh, your gemstones in between and you're going to do that until you get to the point where I've, I've added five and in between each of those peridot there is a seed bead as well mm -hmm. and what that does it kind of sits everything nicely yeah. if, you, if you try and add a peridot to each one it, it, it kind of clumps together and right. don't fit nicely. So That colour combination is lovely. Yeah, thing. yeah, and it, it is really pretty. I, I wish I'd have done it with black thread now and <laughs> keep that. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so, and then just to take it back down again, all we're going to do is, just to bring it back together, is come up through that next one. We're just going to go back to just not adding, and it, it pulls together right. really nicely. So back down through. Tap them together so they're sat nicely. And then you're just going to not add a CB or okay. a gemstone in the middle and bring that up to that side. Yep, and it'll pull together after a couple of these, a mm. couple of rows, it all pulls together again. So bringing those in, give it a little bit of a, kind of hold it and give it a bit of tug and it'll start to pull in together and then skip up and add, add more rows. And then just to tie it together at the end, all you need to do is literally really basic stitching, just threading in and out, in and out, kind of just like zipping it up. Okay. okay. So I'll just finish that, that row. So you can see that's come together again so now they've come back together again and it's all sat nicely mm -hmm. and then like I say I haven't done a, a an example of that but all you would do is link them together and yeah. those eight beads so four at each side you just sew them together just really ah. basically and tie off or just yeah. work your thread through if you don't if you prefer not to tie off Wow, it's really. I think that's quite nice to start off with. Yeah, it's actually. a right. It was really nice, kind of simple design yeah, just to start off with. And it's with. not too and big. And you can take it, it yeah. sort of wider and pop it into a bracelet yeah. design. That's amazing. I like that. Is that not, I think that's a really good thing to start off with yeah. if you've not done seed beading before. That's fabulous. Thank you so much for showing us yeah. that, Katie. Uh, if you've still got that kit in your basket, do make sure um, that you check out as soon as you possibly can and you'll have that home in a couple of days. So I did just type into a search engine. That's the song. <laughs> I think uh, I remember it now. Petite. And the video is amazing, but the image of the, of the plasticine <laughs> model is just hilarious. <laughs> have you not seen the video? You missed watch. It's by Jackie Wilson. Yes, uh, now it's Song. Yeah, yeah video it's kind of is, in my head is, now. Um, it's really, really funny. <laughs> um, righty, ho! Where should we go, Beck? The pub, she says. Ah, rose quartz. Ooh, we see. Rose quartz by itself. If you want a little bit more to add to the kit, or you don't want the kit, you just want the rose quartz, um, you've got the strand by itself here. Eight carats in total. You have really, really pretty. Um, I mentioned when we were doing the uh, Amatrine strand before, the consistency in our microfaceted strands. Every single one is perfectly faceted, like it's there's not one that stands out on the strand it must require such incredible skill it must take years and years of training 
uh, to get to this level. Uh, faceting any gemstone is very difficult anyway, but when you have to facet something of this size um, so perfectly, it must take such a long time. Uh, we think we're being quite conservative when we put one gemstone down to 10 minutes of time in faceting. And when you take into consideration that on most strands there are over a hundred gemstones on the strand, you're talking hours and hours and hours and hours of work, you know, before we've even thought about the mining process, transportation costs and, you know, everything in between, never mind the fact that you've got eight carats of rose quartz. Um, the prices that we take them down to are crazy. It is your Madagascan as well, which in my opinion is the cream of the crop when it comes to rose quartz. It really is a beautiful, beautiful hue. And I think with the rose quartz of Madagascar, more importantly, it's about the diaphanity. <clears throat> so the diaphanity uh, is just so that you get that fantastic, fantastic inner glow from your gemstone, just as you should with rose quartz. VARU98 is your code. £6.95 for you this afternoon, this evening even. Um, all you've got to do is dial the number on the bottom of your screen. It is a free telephone number, so it won't cost you a single penny. Uh, when you come through on the phone lines, there is an automated message which you are more than welcome to listen to if you want to. Uh, but if you're in a hurry, if there is a, a need for speed, just press your number one button, that will put you straight through to the call centre. Um, and you can confirm your purchase then. £6.95, add it to your order. Massive, massive, well done. Um, right, shall we do a star buy? Let's do it. Exactly what I was thinking. I didn't realise we had the slider bracelet there when you mentioned I it earlier on. I didn't actually, it's been hiding. And it's the perfect colour, yeah. isn't it? Um, so, this this is in the uh, product of the year nominations, isn't it? The slider bracelet. I think this is going to win. I really do. I, I, can't, I can't remember the other nominations in there, but I do think this is going to win. Imagine small section of the ametrine yeah oh, perfect how would you do that casey how would you attach those gemstones i in would there? i would do it onto some um either sterling silver wire mm. and uh, do a wrapped loop at each end or even just onto a beading thread like the flex right or something like yeah. that and then pop a crimp bead over it at each end wow that would look Oh, just I'm thinking five, five, yeah. five of those in the middle, and it's great. You know, if you are using five, you can go through the strand, can't you? Pick your favourite yeah, ones. Either the ombre strand. them, or just put put one of the sort yeah. of more citrine colours in the centre, and then yeah. graduate it out. That would be nice, wouldn't it? Really, really pretty. Um, these sterling silver chains were an absolute godsend for me when we started doing these here at Jewelry Maker because um, I do love to work with nine two five sterling silver all the time. Um, I am a little bit fussy like that and I'm not the most confident because I haven't made a huge amount of pieces. So when it came to cutting chain for me, it always made me very, very nervous and I didn't really want to cut it in case, you know, obviously if it goes wrong, it's a precious metal. Yeah. Um, so when we started bringing you these bracelet in two halves it was the answer to all my prayers it really was i was like this is brilliant because we have so many components here at jewelry maker that literally are ready to go you know and all you've got to do is attach them it's so so simple you know even if you've never made a piece of jewelry in your life before you come in and get a slider bracelet you come in and get one of the components and just pop it in yeah and it's the jump ring yeah it's, it's gonna look like um, the same piece uh, of jewellery that the person has made that's been making jewellery for 20 years or more, you know? Um, so it really is simple, simple jewellery making. Now, how the slider bracelet works uh, is it does come in two halves, but it goes through the slider component here. Now, within that slider component, there are silicon inserts in there. And what that does is it just grips the chain enough so that it doesn't freely fall. And, and it also makes it adjustable for you as well. So, you know, if you're not sure of somebody's wrist size, or again, 
Me, I'm very particular. When it comes to bracelets like this, I do like a really snuggle leaf. Yes, like, yes. Like, you I know, do. I really want that to be quite tight around the wrist. Um, but some some of you may want that just a little bit more loosely, a bit more free, freely flowing, um, if you like. But I actually do like, these are brilliant by themselves. You know, even if you don't want to add anything in there, and you want the slider to be the feature because I think that looks really pretty when you've yeah, just you got the, just those bits just a, a single spacer bead yeah. yeah on the other side and just have that as your main mm. feature it would look really pretty wouldn't it yeah 12 pounds and 95 pence for you this evening cbrf 95 is your code 0800 644 35 a 30-day money back guarantee 30 day money back guarantee and perfect gift idea perfect for the present draw as well you know um, and perfect for those quick makes so maybe if you have um some craft fairs coming up soon obviously we've got to be thinking of valentine's day now if you've got some craft fairs coming up soon and maybe you're thinking, I haven't quite got enough. I don't. Yeah. I think I need some yeah, more it's things. It's a like quick top up, isn't it's it? It's really, really quick makes yeah. uh, that are going to give you. A very, I went very to a wedding business. last year, and um, just beforehand, a friend of mine gave me a call. She was going to the same wedding. She was like, "I've got a black and white dress, and I've got nothing to to wear jewelry wise." Yeah. With it. She wanted a bracelet. I just popped some spinel and silver <gasps> spacers in one of those and. Winner, winner. Job done. Uh, Twelve pounds and ninety-five pence. Well, you bit bit delayed there, Leah, but we'll let you off. It is nine thirty. It's fine. <laughs> oh, 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 look at these! Oh, oh my! I love that shape. Gosh, these. Do you know what? These look silver. <gasps> they do. The luster on these is really, really silver. Look at the curve. Look at the shape. Look. At chunky they are as well they are really really chunky bsqf57 is your code for these you have the most amazing amazing pearls how many 21 it's not going to be enough is it high luster oh my gosh like you could literally put your lippy on in those like they're so <laughs> reflective aren't they they are incredible. I think with the shape and size of these, I would perhaps just restrand. Maybe put one of those um, nuggets that we had earlier, They're, those huge nuggets, the uh, quartzite. Yeah. Just one in the middle. They would look phenomenal, wouldn't they? Really, I'd love that blue with the pearls as well. Gorgeous. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, £59 and 95 pence. 5 by 8 to 10 by 14 millimetres inside. They almost have that kind of... Um, uh, like a bluish undertone to them as well. Yeah, you can see that, that bluey, silvery. Yeah, yeah, they're stunning. I love these. Fifty nine pounds and ninety five pence. I would be tempted just to use three again in each ear. Yeah. Long drop on your earrings. Perfect. You've got any weddings to go to next year? Maybe your wedding planning. Maybe you are somebody that specialises in bridal jewellery. Do you know what pearls? First choice every time. Jan's DVD with the pearl setting oh, and having ring. a really old, rather than just the button, just having a really so organic, organic kind of shape. Yes. Beautiful. They're the perfect shape yeah. for that as well, aren't they? You can imagine just that one on the finger there yeah. would be really pretty. Uh, so they're 5 by 8 to 10 by 14 millimetres in size. I will give them a count for you. Uh, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, 42, 44, 46, 48, 50, 52, 54, 56, 58, 60, 62, 64, 65, 65 individual gemstones. How about beach wedding? Yes. My brother-in-law is getting married next year and I was desperately hoping that they would say, yes, it's abroad, <laughs> but it's not. <laughs> Um, £39 and 95 pence for you today. BSQF 57. Do you know what? There's so many gemstones on that strand. It could go such a long, long way. You could make an entire suite with what you have there, couldn't you? How much do you think you'd sell that pair of earrings for, Katie? Ooh, probably about 40 because they're quite substantial pearls. I think you'd have to, wouldn't yeah. you? Especially at that size. Yeah. And actually, talking about the uh, the ring design that Jan does, I think she sells that for £40, £45. Yeah, I think, pounds. I think that's around about £40. Pounds. Something like that for one of them. And I think I counted 65 in this strand. So actually, that is a healthy, healthy return. So if you're using them like that and you're just using maybe two, three, one in pieces, mm. you can make a whole collection. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my gosh, imagine. 
Uh, all for £39.95. Well done if you managed to get those. Um, right. Ooh. Kunzai, look at oh, these. Look at that. <gasps> wow. That's so pretty. That's so lavender. Like, because we will normally get like a very um, kind of lavendery, lilac y, pinky yeah. um, mix going on. That is very, very lavender. It's beautiful. It's very consistent in colour as yeah, well. Yeah, it really is. Um, now, Kunzai is a very, very collectible gem. So I haven't actually seen Kunzai anywhere else. It will be there. Uh, again, we're probably uh, going to have to look, you know, more of our boutique uh, type jewellers and more of our specialist jewellers. Um, but I've not seen it anyway, and I certainly haven't seen it on the high street. 290 carats in total. Now, Kunzite is a very, very phosphorescent gemstone, which basically means that it has the ability to retain light. So it's very much like luminous hands on a watch. Um, take it outside into natural daylight. It absorbs the daylight. It soaks up that energy. And then if you take it into a darkened room, it literally glows in the dark. For me, for that reason, I'm thinking... It's a perfect reason to go out for a romantic meal, isn't it? Yeah. Candlelight, low lit room. Winner, winner. Christmas dinner. Yes. Yes. Leah, yes. Oh, Adam says nice posh fine dinner. Yeah, on your dinner date. Yeah, definitely. And um, I do think it is an incredibly romantic gemstone for that reason. Also, you've got that fabulous colour there, haven't you? That is just beautiful. Now, you've got 290 carats across 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40 gemstones. 40 gemstones, 290 carats. That's an average of 7 carats. Wow. Each. Uh, a seven carat Kunzai ring anywhere. Twenty nine ninety five. Do you know what? I I couldn't part with one of those for less than twenty nine ninety five. Yeah, I, I couldn't. It's Kunzai, you know. That is phenomenal, phenomenal. That price tag. It really is. Okay, GP twenty four. Again, do you know what? If you want to let these go, I don't know. £10 for a pair of earrings. You'd only have to sell three pairs and you'd have your money back, yeah. like six gemstones. I couldn't sell them for £10. I couldn't no. either, but each to their own. <laughs> um, did you say turquoise? <laughs> this is what you could have had. Um, Becky said turquoise. No, she read it wrong. It's turquoise coloured pearls, but we can't do them anyway. <gasps> Look at these. Oh, I love, oh, I love this strand. Lo I love the cubes in gemstones. Yeah. We don't have uh, many of them at all, in fact, the cubes. But uh, when we do, I'm always, I, do, I always see these strands, Katie, and I love them, and I love the shape, but I never quite know what I would do with them. No, I got um, the sapphire cubes a few weeks ago, and... Yeah. <laughs> and uh, I've actually I've put them all together, mm. and I've put the uh, stardust rondelles in between them. Okay. And it sits really nicely. Oh, really, really. Is it nice. a necklace design? Yeah. yeah. Oh, really. I just, I love, and every time I see them, I think, oh, wow, I love that shape. And uh, they're quite modern. It gives them quite a modern edge, I think doesn't there was it? Some on the, the um, Wall of Fame this morning. Oh, really? Yeah, I think there was oh, a, a wire wrapped pendant and some, I think there were lapis cubes, and that she'd wire wrapped them. They're beautiful. Wow. Amazing. I just love them. They're so different and unique. Um, and of course, Amazon, I, I love anyway because it does make me think of white sand and clear blue sky and yeah. mojitos and 32 degree heat <laughs> <laughs> and sleep and a nice book and a lovely rest. Ooh. Oh, I could do with that. I bet everyone could after <laughs> Christmas, couldn't they? 146 carats of your Amazonite you've got here. You've got 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26. Wow. Wow. 26 gemstones, £14.95 pence for you this evening. Do you know what? You can still open your order if you've not opened your order yet today and you've just tuned in. Maybe you've just sat down. Long week, it's been a very busy week for many of us. Um, maybe you're just winding down, maybe you've got a couple of days off work. It is Sunday. You might be lucky, you might be lucky, because normally on a Sunday I might be talking about like the Monday blues that a lot of people get if they have to do Monday to Friday. But we've got an extra day off this week, of course, got an extra bank holiday, some of us. 
RN are you at 76 you can still open up your order now and it will stay open until midnight tonight which means you're only going to pay one postage of just three pounds and 95 pence and um, katie what color findings and why would you use with this i'd either go silver i'd be tempted with rose gold Ooh. rose gold would look nice that would look lovely wouldn't it i always think bare copper with this mug bare copper or antique bronze actually i love both of them with this but again me being me i, I do want to stick with the uh, the precious metal and go silver but i think anything would work with this you know gold would add that richness and that yeah. warmth to it as well it would look amazing the silver is going to brighten it up isn't it and it's yeah. going to add that crisp look about it as well so again get it home try it out you know see put your different colored findings and precious metals next to it and, and see what works best for you how you'd like to use it they're definitely summary for me those ones oh my oh lovely <gasps> Wow. Oh, this oh, is an incredible, so incredible. I love the fact that some of these are like quite flat on the bottom. Yeah. So imagine that as a ring. Yeah. Yeah, you could put pop a head pin straight through. Yeah. Yeah. That's going to look at that light in there as well. They have to be Zambian again, I would say, with these. Look at that inner glow. That's stunning. Really beautiful. And that one has a really flat bottom. Um, so you could. Can you imagine using these as stud earrings? Like gluing a, a post into it and then maybe filling the hole at the other side with like a flat head pin or something. That's a brilliant idea. That is a really, I've never that, thought of doing that with these. Yeah. That'd and that really would bespoke, so really odd as that well. That would be yeah. really designer yeah. as well. Really, really designer looking. There are lots of designers at the moment um, very much using uh, irregular shaped gemstones in their designs. You know, very or everything's very organic at the moment if you look on designers' websites. This is a great way of achieving that designer look at a fraction of the cost. You've got 138 carats. Wow! When we say a fraction, we mean a fraction. Uh, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. 14 16 gemstones at nine pounds and 95 pence that is just pennies each 16 gemstones oh she's asking me to do maths at quarter to ten at night uh 62 pence <laughs> i was just told uh, 62 pence each 62 pennies per gemstone now um quite a while ago now in fact it was before i went off on maternity leave so we're talking over two years ago oh my gosh it's long no no yeah over two years ago um so loads of you were asking for the chunky nugget strands we used to have loads of them uh, back in the day here at jewelry maker and we we just can't get them to the size that we used to have them before we haven't been able to find them anywhere if you are one of those people that's been asking for the chunky nuggets we still can't get those huge ones that we used to have this for me is the next best thing because they are really really sizable and do you know what I love I love them I would never in a million years think to use them in this way but we've had so many strands like this now that yeah. have the spaces in between that when if you have that in a necklace design yeah it's amazing it's and stunning. you can see all around every gemstone yeah they are beautiful aren't they nine pounds and 95 pence fq RU07 is your code. A massive, massive well done if you manage to get those. Right. <laughs> oh. Ooh. Look at these. Very elegant. Really, really elegant pearls you've got here. I always think of uh, the black pearls as your nighttime strand. It doesn't have to be, of course. Um, but again, because you've got that colour, that bold colour that's just going to go with anything and anything everything i quite like when when people just pop one white pearl in yeah, the center just, just and sing, vice yeah. versa yeah. pop just one of the black pearls in with the white pearl strand as well it looks really really uh, pretty really classy as well i think pearls for me personally i've always associated them with wealth um and you know because i've seen so many um you know images of uh, hollywood icons like elizabeth taylor marilyn monroe and audrey hepburn uh, wearing pearls it's you know it's easy just to think that actually to own pearls you need thousands and yeah. thousands of pounds isn't yeah. it yeah i mean before jewelry maker i thought pearls were way out of my reach yeah way out yeah of my reach. in fact yeah. i still can't quite believe how affordable they are here at jewelry maker but it was actually mickey moto that got the the patent on freshwater culture pearls so those of you that are pearl lovers probably have heard of mickey moto 
Um, um, he was uh, a, a guy, uh, a Japanese fella that spent years and years and years and years and years of his uh, teenage years trying to create that pearl that was affordable for everyone. And Thomas Edison, who you may have heard of also, uh, actually said to Mikimoto, you, you're never going to do it. You're never going to succeed. It's impossible. You can't do it. And that made him want to do it even more it made him even more determined and thank goodness he did it because obviously uh, for those of you that are pearl lovers you'll know that your natural pearls can far more far more expensive uh, than your uh, freshwater culture pearls so it now means that we can grow pearls in controlled conditions on pearl farms and bring you pearls that are more affordable and here at Jewelry Maker, we buy in bulk, you know, we buy lots of these. So we're able to get you phenomenal, phenomenal deals. I know more so than others, and from speaking to our customers here at Jewelry Maker, pearls are the one thing that always make people, especially as new viewers, just question it a little bit and think, well, hang on a minute. And this is totally just because of perceived value again. We perceive them to be very expensive. We see prices on screen like we do here at Jewelry Maker and you think, well, hang on a minute, that can't be right. It can't be. We couldn't tell you they were genuine pearls if they weren't. They are genuine freshwater culture pearls and they are just nine pounds and 95 pence, which be, sorry. Uh, all you've got to do um, is re-strand them or learn your knotting technique and knot them. Add a class, jobs are good and family heirloom piece of jewellery. Perfect. They look fabulous, don't they? REGP97, 7 by 6 to 7 by 9. They're just £7.95 now, not £9.95. Nobody pays any more than anybody else. You will all only ever pay that final low closing price tag. It is just £7.95. Wow. And That's whenever I, I have black pearls in my shop, the black pearl earrings just sell. Really? Yeah, for me, definitely. Oh, would you imagine? It's just one of those, isn't it? It's, I think, I, you know, I've said before, black, my wardrobe is full of black. And it's because it's a block colour that yeah. everything else works yeah. with, you know? So, you know, I can wear a black top and black jeans and it doesn't matter what coat I wear, it doesn't matter what jewellery I wear, it doesn't matter what bag I've yeah. got, shoes, everything works with it. And that's why I love it so much. And it's the same goes for your pearls, you know, you could, you could wear those with your white blouse to the office. You could wear them with your jeans and your t-shirt if you wanted to. You can wear them with your little black dress and you can put them with any gemstone as well. REGP97 is your code, 0800-644-655-795. Amber, oh, look at this beauty. Oh my gosh, this is huge. Oh. I always think with Amber as well, multi-buy if you can, and this is because I am very particular when it comes to inclusion. So um, Amber, for me, I need to see a lot of inclusions there. I want to. I think it adds like a um, another dimension to, to the gem. It really does. It's almost like another world in there. And when the light hits those inclusions, it's like burning embers. It's like liquid gold that you have there is a very very lightweight gemstone you could be wearing so much of this and literally not yeah, know you're wearing it because it's so lightweight <laughs> it is the least dense gemstone of them all so it is never measured in carat weight it is measured in size 20 by 19 millimeters in size and in terms of uh, amber generally speaking that's a huge piece of amber that you have there if you go into like any of your silversmiths and you, you know your uh, boutiques and seaside shops as i call them um it's it's such an expensive gem it really is when you see it set into jewelry generally it's always set into solid sterling silver there's no rules with that but generally it is um and it's very very pricey it really is vrgy01 is your code <sighs> I, oh, only 48 chances left, 16 pounds and 95 pence. Pop that onto a head pin. For me, 30 inch chain, done. That's all I would do I'd probably with use a flat, uh, head pin with a flat head so it yeah. doesn't disturb the, the shape at all. Yeah, yeah. that's yeah. a good idea. And then just wrap loop straight on top. Wow, and that, that's, that's all it needs, yeah. isn't it? It's just all it needs. At 16 pounds and 95 pence, VRGY01. Well done if you managed to get that one. Oh. oh, I need these. Oh, I need these. Wings. Yes. 
Oh my gosh. Single rings. Yeah. I don't know which one to pick up now. That one that is one, yeah. <laughs> We'll the go for one. that one. We'll go for that one. We're both singing off the same hymn sheet. <laughs> Look at that one there. Oh, it's ring. Imagine how many you could make from this strand as well. Isn't that just beautiful? Love that. Gorgeous. 360 carats of your yellow tiger's eye bars. 16 by 5 millimetres in size. Rings, individual pendants, earrings. This is such a versatile shape. It really is. I'm going to have to hold all of these up. Do you know what? Have you got some of the blues in there? Does it say multicoloured? No, it does say yellow. I'm sure there's some of the blues in there. Either way. Um, ooh, look at that. Oh, look. That just looks amazing. I love this gemstone so much. Um, 360 carats across the whole strand you've got there in your yellow tiger's eye. Maybe you've got some of the tiger's eye in your stash that you could mix that up with perhaps, you know, maybe yeah. add one into the centre. I'd probably of... go with three of those and then a, maybe a four mil round, something like that, and then another nice. three. Yeah. Just to kind of break it up and it'll give it a nice, a nice sort of space. That would look really, really pretty. Um, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30. 32, 34, 36, and we're about halfway. So you're looking at approximately 72 gem. You see, imagine 72 rings. How much would you sell one of those rings for, Katie? I mean, just, if plate? just plated by uh, probably about £10. That's £720 <laughs> in this strand alone. But the thing is, do you know what? It's, again, obviously, we're not going to sell them all at the same time. Um, but I just, from my I'm just thinking, okay, if I saw a tiger's eye ring, on a craft stall for £10, I'd be like straight away, I'd buy one for myself and then I'd be thinking, oh, who can I get one of these? Yeah. Well, you know when things yeah. are, like, are so great in price that you, you're generally thinking of other people as well, that's definitely what I would be doing with this. DOGP52 is your code, 16 by 5 millimetres in size, beautiful organic strand. Great for the gents as well, actually. So if you just wanted to pop one of these, uh, maybe onto some leather cord, would look fab. It really would. Uh, well done if you've got your water in your basket right now. But just check it out. That's all you've got to do. You're very, 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 very nearly there. And if you have a phone in your hand, just make sure that you are confirming with a call centre as soon as you possibly can. 0800 655. Well done if you've managed to check that one out. That's gorgeous. I love that. There's so many strands that I need to get tonight, and that it's opal been an kit. amazing gemstone night. That opal, that was unbelievable, yeah. wasn't it? Limited edition kit. There is still lots available on the website, by the way. If you go to www.jewelrymaker.com, uh, you'll find lots of treats still there. The prices stay as they are until 8 a.m. in the morning, but then they do go back up. So it really is important that you check out if you want to secure those deals. Uh, so please make sure that you do. Uh, Katie, thank you so much for this You're evening. Welcome. When are you back? I'm back on the 7th Late Show. 7th Late yeah. Show. Oh, the 7th. The 7th. I do believe that is the day that we go live 24 hours a day on Freeview. So yeah. Katie will see you on Freeview on the Late Show uh, on January the 7th. Um, awards here at Jewelry Maker tomorrow, um, all day long. Four awards on each show. So do tune in to find out who and which gemstone and what's winning what. It's going to be very, very exciting. Um, um, big, 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 big Happy New Year to you all. I will be back with you next year. Sorry, I did that joke yesterday. It wasn't for me yesterday. I will be back with you Wednesday now. Uh, whatever you're doing for your New Year's Eve celebrations, whether you're in, whether you're out, or whether you're out, out. Have a great one. Have a safe one. And I shall see you back here on the Mid Show on Wednesday at 1 o'clock. Take care. Watch us on Freeview. We have some very exciting news to share with you. From Monday the 7th of January 2019, Jewelry Maker will be on Freeview HD 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Please be aware that if you have an HD Freeview TV, you'll need to retune from 1pm on the 7th to take advantage of this. 
to ensure you don't miss out on any jewellery making goodies. If you're in an area that doesn't have HD coverage, but you have a connected TV, don't panic. You can still watch JM by going to channel 73, where you'll find our sister channel, Sewing Quarter. Simply click on the red button, and this will give you the option to watch JM all day. Don't forget you can also view Jewellery Maker on Sky, Virgin, Freesat, and the fastest way to shop with us is online at JewelryMaker.com. Or download the Jewellery Maker app. Tune in from Monday the 7th of January for 24 hours of Jewellery Maker on Freeview HD. Are you new to Jewellery Maker? For a limited time we're offering new customers a wonderful free gift. The free gift includes two beautiful genuine gemstone strands in an organza bag. As long as you qualify as a new customer and haven't shopped with us before, then your free gift will be automatically added to your order when you make your first purchase. It's really that simple. Gemstone strands are selected at random, so gemstone size, colour and type will vary for each new customer. Why stop there? Once you receive your gemstones, we'd love to see what you create. Share your designs with us via our Facebook page and join our creative.